Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. Testing. Uh, yo, what's up? Welcome to Venkabod Batman Arkham City action. My name is David. Guys, I seem sort of out of sorts today because I was up all night last night, up all night and up all day, and up all night and all day. But I got a little bit of sleep, which is great. I started starting so late today, I decided between, hmm, should I start late and get some sleep, or should I not sleep at all and, I don't know, cancel a stream, or maybe do like one of those chill streams and no face cam and do some other kind of games, having Batman and Zelda, and I was like, eh, I'll sleep a little bit, I'm sure I'll have enough energy for Batman and Zelda. Right now, it's somewhat in doubt. Maybe I should come up with a, oh, I can change skins now, oh, my god. Well, we should be the fucking Batman Beyond, right? <laughs> Look how goofy he looks. He's so goofy. Dark Tide, a Warhammer 40k Dark Tide? Still on about the Xbox promo games, huh? But I have to finish Catwoman stuff first. So I think that, if I recall correctly, I was thinking about this in the shower, right? Oh, this is kind of loud. I was thinking that uh, I'm really done with her, right? I have to go be Batman for a while so that I can find more Riddler thugs. Because I don't think I want to try and, like, explore... The whole map. I don't think if I look at the map, I think there's no more stuff, right? There's no more things for me. Oh, there is some, right? There's some in the... in here. Right? I need five of them. They're all on my map, I'll bet you. Uh, zoom in like this, right? One, two, three, four, five. Let's go there, then, before we go beat Batman. Oh, wow. Yeah, I feel... I mentioned before the stream started, it's kind of funny how, like, when you're like, impaired. You might not necessarily realize how impaired you are. Wee. Like, I feel like I don't even... It's gonna take me a minute here to get used to the controls of this game again. Like, I feel like I'm not even looking at the screen. Maybe we should come up with an emergency plan in case we can't stream Majora. What should we play tonight if we can't stream Majora? What's something real laid back? Wee. Wow, this animation in this game is so good. Maple Story? I don't know, dude. Did you play through Super Mario, Super Paper Mario, huh? It was on the Wii. No, I didn't, Hubie. Not at all. I only played one Paper Mario game, dude, and that was only played on stream. It was uh, The Thousand Year Door. It was great. I was very critical of it at the time. Um, because you know me, so this is the way I am. Looking back on it, though, uh, you know, like I said this during my stream as well, right? My feelings about the game are kind of complex. It's just that it's an amazing game. And truly worthy of classic status. Just that I think I'm not in the right point in my life to be playing a game like that. You know, it's a story-based RPG. I really wanted more from the gameplay of it. Also, you know, it skews younger in its target audience in terms of the, the gameplay. It's very uh, simple. But it was great. It's a great game. I can see why it's so well-beloved. I'm glad I played through it. Sick flip! That was godlike. Whee! Come on, this is, this is, I never get old, dude. Never gets old. Yes. What's up, Apples? Play Gunbound, huh? Oh, yes! Minesweeper, Skyline, Sims, Neopets. That shitty gotcha game. All good ideas, dicks. All good ideas. I've been thinking about playing Disgaea on stream recently, but I think it's not the right time for that. Uh, this is all, uh, you know, I might just feel fine by the time Zelda comes around. It's probably need to get a second wind. Where am I going? I'm not even looking at my map. Did I even set a waypoint? I think I did. <laughs> Go here. There we go. <laughs> Wee! It's not fun to see, like, a little cat pounce there before she leapt. Such good animation. Yeah, I did the first one exactly, Brian. But I guess second one's the wrong word for it. It feels like I need a second wind. I need a first wind. This game, you know what it kind of reminds me of right now? Maybe I'm just tripping because I'm so drowsy. But it reminds me of the Ghostbusters game. Let me tell you why. Not in the gameplay, obviously, but in the fact that it satisfies a fantasy, dude, in a way that few games do. Like, when you play this game, I really feel like I'm a fucking superhero. Just the way that it animates and the way that it plays. And again, when I was playing uh, the, the Ghostbusters game, it's like I really was a Ghostbuster. And it kind of satisfied me in a very immature way. You know, it reminded me of, you know, my childhood. And, you know, playing Ghostbusters with the homies. 
at the you know, at the playground and stuff. That's how this game kind of makes me feel too. That's why I always gonna be going wee. Cause kind of like you know it's kind of like you really are Batman. In this case, Catwoman, right? Jumping around, climbing on stuff, lashing on things with your whip, slicing guys' faces up with your claws. It's just fucking dope. My life ain't worth it. There's the museum. They all have got guns. If it must be Catwoman, I approve his apples. Thank you, apples, for not judging me. Ooh. It's really cool. I mean, this game has so much uh, attention to detail. That's one of its main strengths. I think not enough is said about this franchise in general. Not only is the environment highly detailed, but also it's crazy how many things that people say in this game. Like, the dialogue is just off the chain. Catwoman cosplay. I didn't think about getting back into City Sims as well, Dix. Been on my mind lately. After that, Sim City uh, going live on YouTube got a lot of views. It was one of our most popular videos ever. Like, I think it might be our most popular gameplay video ever. It's, you never know what's going to be popular on YouTube, dude. It was a four hour episode of Sim City from 1989. And it has a uh, really high average view time for us, anyway. Which is like, you know, 20 minutes out of a fucking... Well, I think it's actually longer than that. It's like half an hour out of like a four-hour video. Average of viewership. For us, that's really good. It had like 30 views in its first week, which is way better than Thirst Track usually gets. And it was a lot of fun. I'm very low on health. My health's not regenerating. I'm kind of surprised by that. Mm, glitch? You earned an... Uh, Astartes in Dark Tide, which might be a good move. What the fuck are you talking about, Steve? If you shave and open that shirt, you can be Talia, huh? Gotta show more boobies, huh? How cool is it that Kelvin's clothes get torn up? Kind of like Batman's. It seems very superfluous. I don't remember this being the way in, in the uh, in the other game, in the in the PS3 version. But it's like the most time you play as her, the vast majority of the time you play as Catwoman is uh, is in the challenge mode. She has a very small part in the story mode, but there is no battle damage in the story. In the challenge, it's kind of a waste opportunity, right? Maybe they should get battle damage in the fucking challenge mode. They have special costumes for the damage version. Oh, that was sick! You can do the, the drop takedown on the on the. This is weird. Oh my god! Almost dead. That guy's in the smoke. He's not gonna be able to see me for a minute here. I wish I could do like a clothesline with her. Look him up. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Okay, it seems like a. Okay, this game had a lot of resources, I guess. The fact that they would give her a battle damage skin, even though it's only ever used like in this one part of the game. All right, I'm here for it. I, I wish all the costumes had that. I also wish that later games of this franchise could actually play as the other characters in the open world. Oh, that's so creepy still. Please, no. All right, where are we going here? Straight ahead to the left. Anybody around here? There is some guys around Good here. Good to see the boss back, right? Yeah, did you see all that gear he had with him? Must have been from the cat. He sent Paulie B over to blow that bitch's secret hideout. Those aren't supposed to be, isn't it? Hopefully there's little bits of burning kitty cat raining down over Arkham City as we speak. That'll teach the bitch to screw with Two-Face. Fuck, you just call me asshole? Space Marines in 40k, the OPAF Super Soldiers, are also known as Adeptus Astartes. You aren't an Astartes in Dark Tide, which might be a good move. Oh, in that game, the game is called Dark Tide. Okay, I gotcha. Who's this? Oh, it's fucking Penguin. Was he unconscious? They wouldn't kill him off, would they? Yeah, they did kill him off. I guess Two Face runs. Ow! <laughs> I don't think I haven't regenerated yet. Got him. This game looks so good. Whoa, shit. I just watched Batman Beyond again. I forgot how messed up the Talia storyline was. Apples, I just watched that show like three years ago from start to finish, and I have no clue what you're talking about. <laughs> Goes to show how good my memory is. Talia's in that show? Oh, I do remember that now. Yeah, 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 yeah. She's, she's like trying to, like, she's talking to, to old man Bruce. I remember that now. Look at all this fucking paper, dude. 
So the penguin's just in there. Oh, he's just chilling. That's hilarious. What the hell are you supposed to be? Piss off! Really? Okay, if you insist. I wish I had fucking oh, lip syncing like I that. Oh, I forgot to say, speak to me like that again, Penguin, and I'll show you just what it feels like for a poor little bird to be torn apart by a cat. Please, don't hurt me. I didn't mean it. That's much nicer. See? You can be nice, Oswald. Well, he's not a fighter? I'd See fight See you him. around. What the hell are you supposed to be? Piss off. Piss off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I skip this? I can. Her dad took over. Yeah, I remember that now. Yeah, her dad took over her body. Right, right, right. He, like possessed her, and uses his voice. Yeah, even though it's uh, her body has his voice. Yeah, that's pretty. Dope. That show is so dope. You should watch the animated series. Oh, Apple's the original animated series. If you haven't already rewatched it. Also, Apple, how about the intro? The intro is so fucking good. All right, so I need to look around for secrets. Anything else around here I want to look at? Does she have dialogue for these things? No. Interesting how, you know, they changed the art style so much uh, from game to game to game, right? This game and Arkham, uh, City, uh, Arkham Asylum have a similar art style, but already you can tell they're going a little more realistic uh, for the, you know, the cartooniness of it. But it is sort of uh, still very comic book-esque, right? Whereas in Arkham Knight, I feel like they've really pulled it all the way back, right? There's not a whole lot of, it doesn't feel as cartoony or ca comic book-ish. Uh, graphically. I got a slider to there, huh? Wee. Where am I going? It's right down here, right? That's where it was, I think. But where? Maybe I didn't go far enough. Oh, I didn't go far enough. What's up, Amplitude? Does this game come with a mature rating? Uh, I don't remember. I don't remember. I, I doubt it. It's got boobies in it, which is great. It's got guns in it, but there's not a lot of, like, blood or anything. How's your night, Amp? Probably pretty good so far. God damn, this game looks good. I ask because of boobies. I think that boobies aren't necessarily uh, on their own worth an M rating. There's not really that much boobies either. And I'm playing as Catwoman. She's DLC. In general, the the boobage in this game is not especially uh, outlandish. Oh, hey, I can get this one here too. Kind of funny how she can get his, but he can't get hers. That's fucking sexist, dude. Down with the matriarchy. Wee. I hope you're having a good night, Amplitude. Arkham City is T, according to Google. It's rated T for teen. Seems a good rating to me. Again, it's, you know, it's uh, very violent. And there is some boobs and a really amazing ass. A couple of them. But uh, this thing is not enough on its own to rate a game mature. There's not any gore or anything. It takes quite a, the boobage to push an M rating. How much boobage talking, Steve? Has there ever been a game that got an M rating because of boobage alone? If so, I should probably check it out, you know, for research purposes. We. It's Catwoman. It's me. Ah, uh, I got my combo. Didn't get hit though. That's weird. All this shit these guys got. There's all kinds of weapons and shit around here. I should probably just stay in free flow, so I can have time be slowed down. Oh, fuck! Even though I didn't, uh... I was able to keep up. I think I'm too sleepy. You don't know me or my mommy, dog. Don't talk about my mommy like that. Kinda glitchy there. This is what you want. Just going from guy to guy, getting crits. Wee. This is just kind of mashing, not really going for like high scores. I'm not trying to go for any variation here. If you like it, why don't we take it off? Think of what you're saying. Whoa, what, what just happened to the camera? I was lucky I actually mashed you both on accident there, but I didn't drop my combo. Oh, I thought I was able to dodge that in time. Oh no. 
Did I get health back at some point? I think I did. It seems as though her whip only hits one person at a time. Oh, it's not. Oh no, I couldn't see my all the blurry uh the blurrow vision there. Oh he's already up, that's pretty quick. Nice. What I miss here. Tease for troglodyte, huh, you cave dweller. I don't trust the internet, but I believe in Dick's ability to Google, huh? Yeah, the guy game. Oh, the guy game, I remember that. I think that uh, AVGN reviewed that game at some point. Well, that's me, but I believe in you as well, Dix. So Oro's gonna be in 3 5 My dude, Crazier Series, gonna have to get on that new grind, huh? You were talking about that earlier. Now it's a new character, and now everybody's gotta play Street Fighter 5. And he's, like, he, Oro's was announced for summer of 2021. He was announced for summer of 2021. That's quite a ways off yet. All right, let's see here. So I gotta get underneath there somehow, for one thing. Uh, there's no one here for her, but there's one here for Bat Mang. But how does Bat Mang get underneath there? This game looks really good. Come on, dicks. Why you gotta hurt me like that? Why you gotta be fucking jealous of Steve? Why you gotta, why you gotta cuck me with Steve, dude? Hmm, well, there's none here for her, but again, I saw one for Bat Meng. Uh, the fuck is this? I remember this. Where does this go? I remember this now. I got some just underneath. Oh, I'm right here. Oh, I gotta do one of these Batarang things. I did not do them before. Uh, okay, I gotta zap it on something. And then get it into there somehow, huh? Somehow. Oh, look, this is where the guy's hammer is. That big guy. Big guy's hammer. Come on, dicks. Come on, dog. Alright, I'll come back as Batman then, I guess. Keep it moving. You call him dog, you little bitch. No, no, dicks. I mean like D-A-W-G-G. -G, two G's. I mean in a, you know, a friendly way. Bleh. All right, so uh, I need to go one, two, three, four. All right. So we're kind of all around here. Wow. Wow. Oh, my God. Look at the cool cell shading. Oh. That ice is amazing. Whoa. I want to get inside there. I have to get underneath. Oh yeah, this place has the weird water. But the frame rate of the water is only 30. Everything else is 60. That's ridiculous. But how do I get over there? I'm Catwoman. I don't have like a raft or anything. Oh, yeah, I can do this. Uh-huh. Oh, I could do that. Let me in. Can I get up even higher? Because there's a one for Batman up there, too, I couldn't figure out how to get before. Yes. Whee. Aha. Uh -huh. Fun. What's up, Tone Box? It is indeed bat time. In this case, cat time. I'm already really enjoying it, even though I'm so tired I could hardly even tell what I'm doing. How deep do you think it is? Deep enough to hold one big ass shark. <laughs> Still can't believe Penguin's got a shark in here. <laughs> That's nothing. He also had some kind of monster under the iceberg lounge. Monster? Salomon Grundy they're talking about. Yeah, some giant dead looking thing. That is bull. It's all true. Yeah, they do. They should probably fix it so even people can. Little J motive. He used to roll with Cabo Pop before switching sides and joining up with Two Face. He said he saw it. And where's Jimmy? I should fix the bot so that people can use him anywhere they want. 
How convenient. Next time you feel like wasting my time telling me about some fantasy crap, make sure the only guy who can back you isn't dead, okay? What? These fish can teleport? That's sick. Maybe they did like some kind of scientific experiment on them, dude. Maybe they're part of Doctor Strange's evil plan. Wow. They're like, see you, bitch. If I did fix it, though, wouldn't people be able to chain commands? Like, multiple in one message. Maybe. Good idea, Dick. So there's a reason why I didn't have it work in the first place. There's some reason why I disabled it, but... I think of a workaround. I just, just used the first one. They have a shark camp, dude. Hell yeah, they have a shark. It's out there in the water. What the hell is she doing here? Oh, they've got guns. Oh, too slow. They're fucking chit-chatting, dog. Don't be chit chat. Sick. Oh man. They have a shark out there. Let me show you guys the shark. Uh, the shark waters. I wonder if I jumped into it, it'd like kill me instantly with the shark. Probably not. Probably just drown normally. But yeah, canonically, there's a shark out here. As well as an amazing, spooky, giant octopus. That's uh, I'm really not comfortable with that. My brother's really uh, got a phobia of like sea monsters. And I usually don't, but uh, I'm really uncomfortable with that. Like, uh, it really terrifies me for some reason. My little monkey brain is getting terrified by it. I'm sure there's some reason for that. So she can't really explore the whole museum, only this part, right? She can't really get across the other way. Cases like Brian, where he can use unlimited of X commands, does it just not trigger the cooldown? Can he use skeleton in another thing, like, easy? No, no, it does trigger his, uh, it does trigger his cooldown. He can only use that same command twice, but if he uses it, oh, there's two-faced boss fight here. She won't dare come back here. She'll dare. She'll come straight back here. Can I swing to something else? I can. Forward to it, sir. Yeah, if you were to try to use skeleton warriors and try to use easy, it wouldn't work. And it does refresh every time. But that's true, the verse does work, yeah. So I had to hit Two Face uh, a bunch of times, looks like. But this boy's talking so much shit. This is gonna be kind of hard, I feel like. There's a lot of thugs, they're all armed. I don't really have any good gadgets or anything. All I really have with her is a silent takedown. She's coming. Does he have a scan of a jig? I think they probably don't against Catwoman, right? Maybe Batman, they'd have him, but... I wonder if he's got really good vision. Boy, what do you know about? You don't know shit. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, no. Don't look down here, please. Oh, God. <laughs> please don't see me. We both want her dead. The first one who finds her gets to be on my right hand. I need a reference to the fucking Batman in the movie. Go, go, go! Oh god! Everyone! Get your asses over here now! Now they're all motivated. I'm gonna hide in the floor if I'm scared. I'm honestly scared. Over here! Now! I found someone! They're finding guys now. Hella dead people. So how many are left? There's one, two, three, four, five, six left. Oh my god! Jesus! This guy's going fuck wild. He's destroying all the fucking gargoyles with the fucking rocket launcher. That's sick. Oh my god! Why is this game so sick? That's two faced here. He's just going ham, dude.
Oh, I'm so scared. I don't want to move out of this fucking grate. It's a great hiding place. This guy's up here just blowing up everything, dude. You gotta leave something. They're all in the second story. Well, I can get up there, too. Actually gives me maybe more flexibility. I'm pretty sure I can't be seen up here. Uh, maybe I'm wrong about that. One way to find out. For science. Exactly. He's Meowdle Gear, dude. Meowdle Gear. Okay. He is just shooting everything. I respect that about him. Pretty cool triceratops head. I can corner cover here. I have to go inside there. I can't really, I can't get through that little steamy spot. Look at all these dead guys. My goal is to leave Two-Face for last, just for fun. But I wonder if uh, that's gonna work. What if he calls in more guys? Who are you calling to? Anybody gonna come and help you? Oh, there's a guy over there. Are they all congregating or nah? It doesn't look like they really are. But they're kind of split up those kind of nights. You got some guys on the top and some guys on the bottom. Which I like. Those guys are just fucking hanging out. Look at the buddy system on point. Go away. Hmm, they're kind of being unpredictable. They're kind of turning around once in a while. They're not always walking the same direction. They kind of stop and they turn. Because they're paranoid, dude. Looking over their back. God! Everyone, get your asses Finding more dead now. guys. I don't want to care anymore, dude. There's like a bunch of guys already dead. Where you going, dog? Don't let her get to us. Just start walking so I can get behind you, dude. There he goes. Okay, I think I want to be over here. No one on this side at all. There's somebody over there. Don't kill her, dude. He's just shooting off in general. He's not even actually hitting the gargoyles. Thought they might be destroyed. Wasn't there somebody up here a minute ago? He's moving quick. Got another one down over here. Ooh, so tense. How many is there left? One, two, three, four, five. Are they respawning? What if they're respawning? That was my concern, right? After to actually fight him without taking them all out first. Maybe they're respawning from somewhere. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wasn't there six last time? How many fucking bodies there are? Ugh. They're respawning. So I can't just take out Two Face by himself for the chuckles. Oh, this is kind of clear, though. It's kind of transparent. It's not great. Huh? Ouch! Get over here! I found the bitch! Whoa, that was sick! Parkour! I lost. Oh my I god, that was fucking sound. godlike. Oh, hey! Why is this game so sick? If I had to guess, Brian, they probably start, start, I mean, I have to memorize where they all ended up, right? The They've probably been already Find vanishing, is my guess. guess. The bodies. They've probably, probably been vanishing. I don't remember where they were. Jesus. 
That's a loud. I wish I'd do it silently. The dodge of J Motor, that was so much fun. I'm at the end. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's six again. You can only just kill the guy. There's definitely only six, right? There's definitely only six, but there's gonna always be six. So she can do a sound taken from, from above, but not from below. How many is there now? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, no, it's still five. No, he's getting away. It's okay. I'm not sure which way he's facing it for a second. It'd be sick if there's like special dialogue for overkilling thugs. Huh? Maybe you're right. Might as well try, Tomba. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, they're definitely respawning. Okay. We gotta start hitting this guy then, I guess. It's gonna be tough. Look at all the fucking dead bodies, dude. They don't know how many thugs I can kill. Maybe you're right, Tone Box. Because so many cute little Easter eggs and stuff. Maybe they like, can kill like enough of them and something will happen. But I also really want to kind of move on from this, too. So I can get to the, uh, I mean, he's shooting rockets like crazy, but I think that's just, uh, I don't know, a fun animation. I thought he was destroying the gargoyles at first. I don't think he is. He's just kind of shooting it off just to be intimidating, I suppose. So, I mean, really, I should just get up there and mess with them. The you know, heart pieces, Brian, huh? I'm here for it, dude. You know me, I love them heart pieces. There could come a point, hypothetically speaking, where there's so many dead bodies in the ground that... I can't hide anywhere anymore, because they're more alert around a dead body, you know what I mean? It doesn't mean no good than to take them out at all. There's no advantage to that, I don't think. But I do want to get up to a, a vanish point, I think. Three hearts or die, huh? Oops, wrong button. It's going to be kind of hard to... They're kind of spread out in a very uncomfortable way right now. It's going to be hard to move. This might be my shot to get somewhere. I think he'll see me up there or something? Like, he is shooting his rockets, like, up. Is that supposed to indicate to me that he's, like, looking up? I don't think he is. He's just shooting like a maniac. I gotta get a silent takedown on his ass for sure, but he's just got his thugs around him right now. It shouldn't be that. As long as he's not looking up, it shouldn't be that hard, right? I need to. Right now, for instance, get a silent takedown. <laughs> we gotta get the fuck out of here, like, ASAP. What are you waiting for? Help me! Don't let it get away! Oh, fuck! I didn't see that guy there. Take two. So now I know I don't have to kill anybody. Doesn't seem to help me, though. Sorry, kitty. Come on, dog. You're gonna shoot me in the head, dude. Do you wanna be friends? Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? Okay, so where's he at? He's in the middle right now, right? She won't dare come back here. Yeah, I wish she could, she could jump to that, but she can't. She can do that, though. little things, and when she does, I want you guys to blow that bitch apart! I'm looking forward to it, sir. So I've got cow trips I can make use of. This is our chance for glory. Word is Joker's dead. We all saw what happened to the I wish I had, you know, like a smoke bomb, but I guess I don't. That's just the struggle of Catwoman, dude. 
I think I hit somebody in the head with it, it knocks them up for longer, come to think of it. There's like a whole mechanic I forgot about. Yeah. You get like a headshot, and they get like knocked out for longer. I think you take a thug out first, though, so they start to move, right? Otherwise, he's gonna be in the middle the whole time, it's gonna be pretty much impossible. Does she have like a vertical takedown? I think she doesn't, right? Or does she? No, she's a drop attack. Boring. Keep looking. She could be here already. She might be. <laughs> Being seductive. I hate Catwoman and her big old boobs. She's so fucking seductive. I want that trophy. Can I jump to that? We. Uh, not really. Because of invisible wall problems. What the? Oh no. Grenade. Grenade. You can just mash this, I believe, right? Wow! Was that three then? Thought I was too high for them to see me, but. Heads or tails? I guess not. Heads or tails, kitty cat. Uh, heads? Fuck it, actually, you know, heads. Well, you're free to go. We gotta take a thug out so they get kind of split up. All those prisons. This is gonna be loud or not? That bitch That's gonna be loud though. What? So I can go up here and go up there. There we go. Her doesn't go as far as Batman does, but that's fine. It's kind of what you'd expect. So there he goes. He's by himself right now. New plans. Can I pounce over sure there? The I okay. can. Something I get used to, her with, used to with her is different from Batman's. Hers is really long ranged. Which can be a you know a pro and a con. What are you waiting for? Help me! Stop her! Does he know where I am? I don't think he does. Oh, he does. Oh, fuck. She's up there! I lost her. That's how that works. That's how that works. Doing. How are you going to use those things if they're not here? No, we're going to be destroying those, dog. I think only one of them does that, though. Oh, they're all here. I got to watch the guy who's destroying them and take him out. But they're all right here. Fuck. This guy's destroying the things. Come on, get him. Oh, there he is, too. All by himself. How convenient. Please, Kevin, please jump up there. Please, 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 please. Oh, wow. I guess I can't do that. I have to run, I suppose. Because her jump is really slow compared to Batman's. What's up, Kevin? And the judgment is... Death. I think you might be right about that, Kevin. Yeah, I've been in the game before 100%, so I think I know what you mean. That was unfortunate. That was a really good run there. But uh, she didn't want to jump up to the platform the way Batman does, because he has, you know, he has the grappling hook, she has a whip, so it's not quite as effective at that, she I guess. Dare come back here. And besides, if I were to kill them from this, or, or try to leap to this while they see me, they destroy them as well, which is kind of a pain. Pretty little things, and when she does, I want you guys to blow that bitch apart! I'm looking forward oh no! To it, Good. This way. She went this no, way. not gonna work. These invisible, invisible walls are killing me, dude. I want to like leap over. I want to leap over them, land behind them, and grab them. But I hit invisible walls like, oh no! She won't dare come I'm about to bounce off this wall real quick if you don't mind. Oh, what wall? What wall are you bouncing off of, girl? Little things, and we I don't know. Does. Just a wall. You guys to blow that bitch apart. I'm looking forward to it, sir. Good. This is our chance for glory. 
Word is Joker's dead. We all saw what happened to the brunt that used to run this place. <laughs> We're gonna get out of here now. But now I can get up to these platforms. So I gotta find the body first, or else nothing's gonna happen. Still deciding what else I want to use the transparent PLA for other than a predator model and maybe a solid snake. Do whatever you want, man. Just make it clear. Just do whatever makes you happy, but make it clear. She'll be here. I know she will. You think so? I'm not convinced myself. I'm kind of scared. If I were her, I wouldn't come here. This is, uh, I've already died, like, what, like ten times or some shit. Yeah, I can't hit him all they're right there together. That's just not going to happen with her. If I were Batman, I could put a smoke bomb down there, but, uh, with her, not so much. I have to have them find the body. Here. Oh, there we go. So now they're moving. Now I gotta watch him and just get these stealth takedowns and find a place I can run to. I can't jump to the platforms in time for them to not find me. I have to find a place I can run. I gotta make sure I've got like an escape plan, basically, wherever I go. Invisible snake, but under a box, exactly. Dude. That'd be that invisible snake. So he's just chilling there, unfortunately. This guy's gonna pass by this way. He's gonna keep on walking, he's gonna keep on walking. Pretty well protected, this guy. I like how he just fucking gets salty and starts blowing up everything. He's by himself now, but uh, is there a thing up here I can latch onto? How by yourself are you, dog? Not really that by himself. What are you waiting for? Help me! She she saw me. Ooh, took some damage there. This is really, really hard. Oh no. There's nowhere to hide back here. Damn it, I lost it. She's gone. Run! It's like Trinity when I run, dude. The animation. So now where is he gonna be next? He's going across the top again. No one saw me on the gargoyles though, so I can go right back to them, I suppose. He's going to the middle, looks like. Can I get a ledge takedown or something? That'd be convenient. No, I can't necessarily. Boy, they are fucking everywhere. I need to take him out now. Hopefully that guy walks past and then turn to face me. Fuck. Damn. See, if I take him out right then, I could have run across this way. There's nobody on this side of the whole place. I have all the room in the world to run to. But it didn't really work out that way. I told you she'd be here. So this is again, sure. I have to choose my time very carefully. Because if I kill him right here in the middle... Uh, and they're all surrounding me, I will have nowhere to run. I have to, find, I have to make sure there's an escape route. She's not as nimble as Batman is, because Batman can kind of like glide and point himself where he wants to go, but she just kind of leaps, which is very inaccurate. A little bit TLQ. Oh, I beat the game at TLQ. The game's already over. To us. I'm doing post game stuff now, and I'm trying to wrap up 100%. How's your day been, dude? If you look at the title of the stream, it kind of explains that. All right. Mmm, now it's not looking good right here. It's not good enough. There's too many guys around.
Do I play this game before EZOQ? It's a mighty fine game. I recommend it if you haven't. I could probably hit him with a bola in the head to do some damage to him, maybe. Here's a good shot for me to escape. Kill who? Kill nothing, dude. I saw on your way to 100%, so I was asking what percent are you at? I'm sorry, I have to take you. It's okay, it's Brian. Hardly anybody bothers reading stream titles. Yeah, we're probably like a week and a half out from beating the game, it's okay, like completely. Yeah, I think it was a uh, miscommunication, dude. It's my bad. So where is he? He's going down there now. And he is by himself right now. I gotta get over there. Uh, no, I'll get over here. Get to the ceiling. Oh no. This sucks. This really sucks. <sighs> Fuck, man. How did they know I was there? I think he sees me. I think he gets knocked down. He's like, what are you guys is... doing? Help me. He, he knows where I am. I have to get uh, really far away really fast. Wow, this is really fucking tough. That was like a percentage meter thing. I know we're talking about like com game completion, all the secrets and stuff, you basically. Come back here. There's so many thugs. Dude, I'm actually kind of getting impatient here. Like, I'm gonna want to quit. I want to just have a way to do this really cheap and easy, but there's not, I don't think. Like, I want to just cheat at this point. But even if I want to, I don't think I can. Word is Joker's dead. We all saw what happened. Yeah, there's only like one great. I wanted to run that way. That was my plan, Brian. That was my mistake there, honestly. My plan was to take him out and run to the great. But since I took him out, I heard, huh? I looked over. There's guys down there. They move so fast. No one will dare stand. I wanted to go for the grape, but then I turned there and there was guys there. So I wanted to go for the for the ceiling, and there's guys there too. But I swear the whole reason I jumped him in the first place was that there wasn't any guys there. That's why I did that. But you know, they move. It takes forever to, you know, take them down. She'll be here. And in that time for me to take them down, they just I guess they're everywhere, dog. Yeah, my whole plan there, I had an escape plan and everything. It was to choke him out and then run all the way across and then dive into the grate. But then I saw those guys over there, so I went, I'm going to go for the, for the, uh... I'm going to go for the, uh... Ceiling panels instead on the right. But they, are, they had my path Don't blocked. Let me down. She gets here. They had my path blocked. Dead. This is the most annoying shit, dude. Why do I fucking actually, like, choke out some guys? They spawn indefinitely. Just have them already be moving. This is so annoying. He's gonna find him there, though. The first one who finds her gets to be my right hand guy. That was Bob, right? That was Bob from Batman uh, the movie. His number one guy. Joker's number one guy. All right, so now they get to move around a little bit. I almost feel like I wish there was a way I could knock them out and have them not respawn. But the only thing to do that is to whip, whip, whip. It's the triple whip. It'd be very loud. It'd be very loud and wouldn't last all that long, honestly. It lasts longer than just punching them out. But not long enough to count like a, you know, essentially have them be out of the fight. One, two, three, four. You have to know where they're all at. That's not my problem right now. One, two, three, four, five. Perfectly spread out, of course. There's nowhere to hide. Is there? Where can I hide on this floor? Is there? A, there's a ceiling panel over there. It looks like. 
feel like you want to be on the bottom floor if you're going to take people out, or take them out, because he's, uh, there's so few places to hide up here. It's a pretty whack game design, guys. I gotta fucking vent here. Because I have no agency. I have to just wait until they're in the right pattern. I don't have any gadgets that are any use against these guys. So all I can do is wait and hope they're gonna go to the right spots and I can get a bit of damage and then wait again. We're gonna think about this the wrong way. No, he shot his own guy. That was hilarious. Maybe I, I maybe I can't escape? Can I fight them? Not really. I got bolas, I got uh, cow trips. I can put some cow trips down. But that's not gonna really super help me. I wonder how long, I think they, they kick them away. For a while they kick them away. They don't last forever. It'd be nice if they did. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Their pattern's so weird. Look, he's walked one way and then turned around and walked the other way. And they're like they're like at the, the level of they're very annoying. Yeah, let's put it that way. When you're playing as Batman, they only have unpredictable patterns. Can you just pounce attack him and run? I'll try that, Brian. Let's just for, I'm gonna die anyway. Let's try, try the bullet for science. If I had to guess, I'd say that you have to do a little bit of everything to take him out. Kind of like. Uh, Kind of like, uh, freeze. I'm sure I can't bowl him twice, or if I do, it's gonna be very little damage. Uh, it came from over here, I'm sure of it. No, it didn't hurt him at all. I think I have to get a takedown. Maybe a pounce would work, though. Rip that bitch a new one! Where the hell are you? I wonder if I can kill all the thugs. Maybe if I kill like 30 of them, they stop spawning. This seems pretty ridiculous. Uh, go away! So, is anybody over here? There's one guy over there. So I couldn't really pounce him and run that way. Fuck! Dog, what are you camping there for, dude? Go somewhere! Find the bitch! Don't let her get away again! If he blows his own guy to the players. I can't even pounce attack him, dog. They're just fucking camping. Uh, maybe the AI is glitched out. I'm gonna go take out somebody, I suppose, and see if I can make them motivate again. Huh? Kill her. Who saw me? Don't let her get away. Who fucking saw me? I was leaping through the air. <sighs> it's a lot of guys. For glory. Word is Joker's dead. We all saw what happened to the runt that used to run this place. <laughs> we are the future of Arkham. We are I'm gonna feel like just killing guys for the remainder of the stream and hope they stop spawning. No Because this is getting us nowhere. Us. Cut them in two. What the How? He wasn't even facing me, dude. What the fuck? Fucking salty, dude. He was like, Huh? She won't dare come back here. 
salty as fuck, Brian. I have to sneak up behind Two Face Sticks and hit him and then escape. Uh, probably like, I don't know, six times or so. But the problem is, all of his homies keep respawning. So I don't really understand what they want me to do here. Except be extremely clean and very, very, very patient. I can't dick, they all got guns. I would love to run and kick his ass, trust me. This is how I feel right now. Nothing would make me happier. It's so hard to keep track of where they're at. There's so many of them. Like, her, you know, her invisible vision is not the best. Keep looking. She could be here. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So like I already respawned. I was kind of hoping maybe if I killed them before they, they noticed, they wouldn't respawn. But no, they just always respawn very rapidly. Even there's not, there's no advantage to killing them whatsoever. It would seem to me. I was kind of hoping that maybe if I killed them, uh, there'd be like a, a window where there'd be fewer guys. Or that they have to spawn from a certain spot, maybe. And I have, if, I, if I knew where they spawned from, I could maybe wait for him to be on the other side of the place and then kill some guys. But no, not really. They just sort of just reappear. Think of the raid jump. Hey, welcome aboard, dude. Just in time for some salty, salty Batman action. I'm kind of pissed She'll off. She'll be here. This is so fucking tedious. I'm about to just hit this guy with a fucking bola. If I do this, will he... Will he start attacking the... I'm not sure if he'll start attacking the, uh... These things. The gargoyles. So now they're moving. Yes. So definitely that's the way you want to do it. You want to bola that guy to, to trigger them to start moving. Where are you? I'd love to take him out right now, but he's got a fucking guy right there behind him. He always does. Do you want to go somewhere, asshole? Be just happy to just chill there. Jesus! How's your stream jumping? What are you playing, dog? I wish there was a silent way to knock a guy out from far away. Like, I wish the bola was silent, you know what I mean? So I could hit him in the head, and that'd be one guy down, and I could take down Two-Face, and I could run. I wish I could... I wish there was a ceiling thing over there. Like, where do I even run from if I take him down right there? He's gonna be there forever, he just camps there now. But there's, like, nowhere I can run to. There's no ceiling platform there, there's no grate or anything. All there is at best is this fucking gargoyle. I can't even, like, jump straight out, because that's where they're coming from. They're going to see me. What about over there on the far left? Is there a ceiling thing over there? Maybe there is. So there's at least boxes and shit. Play some more magic, huh? I want to get a CRT so I can stream some retro. That's the ways out, I think. Huh? Why don't you play emulators, Jumper? Yeah, doing analog video capture is a huge pain in the ass. Dude, what is this shit, dog? Why are they doing this? What is with this game design right here? He's just there, of course. I can't I have no way to influence where he goes. It's just totally random where he walks to. All I can do is just wait and hope for the best. One, two, three, four. I see four guys. Where is the fifth one? Under there. This is like as good as it's gonna get, right? And that's not that great. I hope there's somewhere to hide over on the far, uh, like straight ahead of me right now. I could have pounce attacked him there, but I might as well knockout smash. That thing did more damage. Help me! There we go. So there is something over here to hide on. I know where all the hidey spots are, and make sure you have an open path there. I think the only reason I would use emu is if I stream Nintendo DS games. Huh? That way you don't have to, it's kind of hard to capture after like mod a console. Love your YouTube video. Oh, thank you a good vibe. I'm really excited about Friday, guys. Friday is our pizza and a movie uh, viewer's choice triple feature. 
Check out our YouTube channel for voting. Just vote on which game you want to watch. It's going to be a lot of fun. More fun than this bullshit. I think a good vibe. As long as you vote on YouTube or Patreon or Discord or Twitter or Facebook or wherever, I will tally them all up. Wait, what are you aiming at? So there he is. I think he's by himself. One, two, three, four. He's, he's by himself. Let's go. Don't let her get to us. Did he see me? Go, 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 go. Well, I got him. So we have to do it four times, looks like. How's the game going? Are you real far in now? Yeah, good vibe. I beat the game already. We're doing post-game stuff. This is the final, 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 final secret boss fight. It's really fucking annoying. I super duper hate it. But it looks like it only takes four hits to kill. So maybe we'll be able to pull this off before the end of the stream. So he's up on top now. All of his homies all together, bunched together. Is that two guys just kind of kissing over there or what? I think he's back in the middle again. That's like the worst spot. Maybe I can bean him with a bola and make him move. I mean, maybe he'll move somewhere else, even though he doesn't actually take any damage. Just get him out of like the worst position. So I need to get back to a gargoyle. What's up, Bruce Marco? We're playing on PC, Bruce. This is the uh, original release on PC, not the uh, the remaster. It looks great, though. It's harder than you would think to get to a cargo with, with her as well. So there's one, two, three guys over there. Four. Where's the fifth one? One, two, three, four, five. There they all are. So I want to go up here then and get on this gargoyle. Oh, wrong way. Okay. I'm back on top. So this is a good chance to try a pounce attack, right? I just want to try a pounce attack if I can. Who's around here? Guy right there. One, two, three, four, and a guy right next to him. <sighs> Don't mind me, just moseying through. From a streamer perspective, what's your upload speed? My upload speed, like for my ISP, is uh, 40 megabits per second. But you only need like 10 to have a solid stream. Not even that, hypothetically speaking, as long as it was stable enough. You would need like, you know, to stream, you just need basically 5 megabits per second upload consistently. That'd be plenty to stream with, to have a very high quality stream. I told you she'd be here. Kill her! Dog, I'm about to fucking make some popcorn, dude. What am I gonna do about wait and watch? Look at these guys, man, they're crowding them. I have no tools at my disposal to control where they go. Can I whip from here? No, I can't. Yeah, but at best, you're not gonna be able to stream that, I'm afraid, Bruce Mark. Unless you stream retro. If you stream like NES games or SNES games, that'd be plenty. As long as there's no face cam. Even with a face cam, probably. As long as it's stable 1.8, or, you know, uh, I've seen streams as low as, like, 500 kilobits per second for SNES, for NES games Find that were fine, bitch. that looked Don't great. Let her get away again. Exactly. And honestly, yes, he's 144p, right? That's what I mean. For retro games at a very low resolution, it's not that big of a deal. You would be surprised. Twitch also has a really great built-in upscaler. I was super impressed by Twitch's upscale when I was watching the stream I'm talking about. I had a friend that streamed at uh, 144p at like 500 kilobits per second at, at NES games. And it looked awesome on Twitch. Okay, here we go. What? Girl, if you don't go to a goddamn gargoyle, I'm... Oh my god, dude. Holy fuck. What the fuck? It's like, does she have like a cooldown or some shit where she can't gargoyle after taking a guy out or something? It did some damage. I didn't do a whole lot of damage to him. 
No near as much as a takedown. I have to do two, I have to do like four more of those to kill him. But I mean, it is more safe. It's She's way back. more safe. Oh no. Oh, he's way over there. Oh, no. Oh, I'm so unfortunate. Oh, God. He's all by himself over there and I can't move. Fuck. Give me the follow boost, Marco. Look at this shit. They're all here, but they're all right underneath me. I really hate this mission. This is DLC at its worst. This was not especially well thought through, I feel like. Mechanically speaking. Alright, well, they're all broken apart now, but unfortunately that also means that they're all spread apart. So he's kind of chilling. Is there a way that I can... I can't really lure them all into one spot, right? I kind of almost had like a situation there, right? Where I kind of lured them into one spot. That'd be convenient to do as like a diversion. But uh, they don't do the same thing for when they find a body. I do have a YouTube boost marker. Indeed I do. Yeah, it's on just find Venkabot on there, dog. So I've been saying dog a lot today. I think it's uh, me expressing my sleepiness. Punch in Venkabot, you'll find me on YouTube, man. New videos every single day, believe it or not. I've been streaming for three years, Bruce. Full time for three years. I don't make any money doing it before you ask. Just enough for, you know, the bare necessities, and even then, not really. But it's really fun and really rewarding. I told you she'd come. Get her! The bare necessities. I need to get out of here and get to a gargoyle, I guess. She has to be, like, right next to it. Yeah, okay. She, doesn't, she can't, like, whip to it, I see. She has to climb the wall to it. So he's down there now. <sighs> wow. Nice little entourage you got there, homie. I mean, there's six of them, dude. They're everywhere. Like, what do they want from me? Again, I have no way to, to divert them. There's no, like... I can't, like, plant a bomb somewhere and detonate it. So they all go, whoa, what was that? And run over there. Don't let her get Even if us. I kill one of them, they don't actually come. They go, hey, guys, come here. And they're just like, no, why would I? I do that. Kind of like when, you know, at a certain point when you're playing Batman, they do the same thing. And they stop coming to the, where the bodies are. I can throw cow trips down. That slows them down, which is great. It's important. Don't get me wrong. But even then, they have guns. They just shoot me from far away. Like, again, there's six guys. They're not going to clump up all that often. I can tell that you have done it for a while. Thank you. I'm glad you're enjoying the show, Bruce Marco. Put a lot of work into it. I'm very proud of this channel here. Again, it's very entertaining. Sometimes a little bit salty. Dare I say. Maybe even a lot of the time, very salty. That's just the way video I games told are. You dude. She'd be here. Kill her! Kill her! So that's him right there. I definitely. I don't know, man. It's kind of hard to tell. I guess. It really depends on the situation, right? Like, pounce is good sometimes, I think. And other times, choke is good. This room is not big enough for fucking six guys. It did really shit damage, Brian. I think if I hit Pounce like five more times, it would kill him. Does whipping chip more damage than takedown? Uh, no. Whipping doesn't do any damage, unfortunately. 
But the thing is, Brian, you were right that it recovers way faster. I have a much better chance of hitting and running with the pounds. And so it might be the more safe option, but just, you have to wait for more of this, more of this tedious waiting. Because you have to hit him more times. He, he'll die in two more takedowns. But it'll take like five more pounces. Yeah, again, this is just sort of a game design devoid right now. It would make sense if I had ways to divert them or some kind of tactical, you know, something tactical going on here. But I don't think I do. I think that they just really want me to wait. Don't let her get away again. Or kill all the thugs. And I just didn't understand that. Maybe, maybe I can kill all the thugs. We have to kill 20 thugs. And they'll stop coming. What's up, machine? It's me, Austin. What's good? It just blows my mind again that there's six guys in this tiny little map and they want me to take him down when there's nobody around him unless I misunderstand I got I throw caltrips I only have, I have three charges of caltrips per map and he only has two more takedowns left on him so I could use these now but the thing is you know I would have to find I have to place them very quickly and know where he is know where they're at put them in their path and then take him down like, right now, I can put him on stairs, for instance, on both sides, and people have to come from the bottom. But yeah, it's kind of tricky. So he's like on an AI loop where he's patrolling the bottom, I realize now. Kind of like he has like little loops he does, right? So basically, them all being on the bottom now is like the worst case scenario. They should all be on the top. If they're on the top, then I'd have a shot. I could unloop him maybe by hitting him in the head with a bola. Like, I guess there's, there is a, that's the best spot right there, right? Because I know I can run over there now. It's tricky, tricky, tricky to revenge. SSX tricky. Don't let her get to us. I want to bowl, if I'm going to bowl, I don't want to be on a platform now. Let's do it from up here. I don't know. I have to get, I have to get to a platform is the thing, right? I have to get to a, to a gargoyle to move. And then they're going to shoot me. Trick boost times three. I'm afraid of bowling him from a platform because then I start shooting the platforms. These gargoyles, I mean. They're all kind of behind stuff right now. He's right there, though. Yeah. Yeah, I wonder if that's. We might as well try that, Brian. But I think that only counted because was, it was the first one. I don't think he really cares at this point. Oh no. Don't be shooting it, dog. Come on, where are you? I think he let it go. He let it go. Yeah, I think it's a different kind of cycle at first. That's the cycle where no one knows I'm here. So he's kind of chilling in the middle. If I did, I think if I had to change his AI now, I'd probably hit him with Ebola. Because I think I want him to be right there. That's going to be the best spot for him to be. I have a very controlled act. I, put, I could put, like, caltrips right there and right there. And I'd be pretty much safe right there, more or less. Oh, what's going on here? This is my shot. I don't really have an escape plan, though. I do it on that side. What? Oh, they know where I am. Magically. I thought there was a thing over here. I did okay damage though. New plan. We search the room for the bench. Look everywhere. We'll find her. We do it. How is that a new plan? What have you guys been doing this whole time? He's going up to the top. Well, oh, I wish I could fucking find him. I wish I can get up there now. 
I have to get up there, dude. This way. Now Welcome tell me up. where you've hidden the rest of my Easy stuff. game, Ryan. Even out the other side of your face. <laughs> I only took half. The rest I gave away. I win, bitch. <sighs> Enough with the twos already. <gasps> Amazing. <gasps> so what kind of worked there in the it end? It just keeps getting you into trouble. Was letting him see me, letting the guy see me on accident, of course. Mm -hmm. That mm -hmm. did work twice to get them all clumped mm -hmm. together. Mm -hmm. Boy. I mean, that seems like that would have been a pretty strong strategy. If only I had a way to make sure I could be seen, but not take a lot of damage. That's very lucky, Hubie, indeed it was. I was really confused there for a second. Just couldn't keep away, huh? Can't say I blame you. I thought it was actually still Terry. still to do here in Arkham City. Good luck with that. Some enterprising individuals decided to help themselves to my things. I intend to get it all back. Oh, so she's not going to leave the city, I gotcha. Seductive lock. Look at this fucking dude, man. Look at my dude's ass, bro. Oh my god. Oh my. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is great. Okay, so with Batman, uh, there's a few things I want to do. Well, first of all, I want to go back to that place with Catwoman. You think it's America's ass, dude? Oh my, oh well, yeah, it could be a lot better for sure. But still. still Come on, give him a little smack. Isn't it a shopping mall now? What is a weird ass belt? It's like not even a belt at all. It's just a, I guess it represents a belt? Maybe it's a call back to Batman's iconic look from the future? It's just a bunch of things stapled to his waist. So how do I change the Catwoman? I really don't understand. I probably have to her apartment, right, you would think. That's almost a grandpa ass. I don't know, dude. That's pretty harsh, it seems to me, bro. I feel like you're hating right now. Oh, there it is. It gives me some markers here. So what is this, her apartment? And what is this? Is everyone on this side of town? There is, right next to where I'm standing. This spot here, the stain? Oh, there's a cat here. Hello? Switch. We gotta go back. It sticks with spearmint gums taped to his suit, pretty much, dude. With the wrapper still on. Oh, you know. I think I'm going to enjoy this. Kind of weird animation there. Oh. He's always hella fresh. You're probably right, Dick. I feel like he needs a foam donut to sit anywhere or else his butt gets sore, huh? I don't know. Maybe you're right. I can just chill here. No, I can't. Not forever. Catwoman doing here? It's not bad, Ow. Man. Hey, fucking still alive. Oh, I choked him for so long, though, he was like, had extra long stun. That's hilarious. You're gonna die. What was that? Did you guys see that? Somebody clipped that? What, what was that? What just happened? Is that an Easter egg? Plus one loot. Oh, there's a whole other side quest here. Okay. So he gave away the the loot. So now some thugs have it. Okay. I thought it was an Easter egg. Looks like you have a loot meter below your life bar now. So it's a whole other side quest we have to do. That's kind of fun. Kevin says I've used my thief vision. It tells me where they're at. Hey guys! What's Catwoman doing here? We. DPs! Whip DPs! Show where the loot is at. Gotcha, Kevin. I'm not really in a hurry to do that, though. I'm really, my goal is to get some trophies here. And then move on with our lives. I wonder if there's any loot in here, though. Probably not. 
Go, 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 go. Save the Trinity run, right? I know, man. Catwoman made him look pretty dumb. Dialogue, boys. Sick. Oh no, that's all I wanted. Oh, I still got away with it though. Time dilation for the win, I guess. Hold the shit! Oh my god! So satisfying. Okay, so I have to come back with Batman to get those ones. That's no big deal. I have to go back to that room I was just at, the, the Two-Face room. There's a hell of trophies in there that I missed. Alright, riding. Riding on him, dog. So here's only one way to get around. I have to go over here, then climb off of this, and go underneath. Go double underneath, which Batman cannot do. Which is kind of fun. It's kind of a missed opportunity. TBH. To have, you know, more exploration, more characters. That's what the franchise should go, if you ask me. But, I don't know. Where do you think it's going to go, guys? Let's hear your theories on the new Batman game. Or if it's going to be... I guess it's not a confirmed Batman game, is it? It's confirmed that Rocksteady's working on, like, a game. But not confirmed to be a Batman game. So what now? You guys know my feelings on I Arkham Knight. hang here until someone tells us what's happening with Arkham's... Do they have guns this time? No, they, they don't have guns. Whoa! The luchador moves. Ride. Ride. Oh, so it's not fucking two-faced, but it's not. It's just some random thugs in here. Making my life hard. Yes, I am. Oh, God, the shotgun hurts so bad. Dang. I, like, mashed X and got something special to come out. That was not, like, my normal dodge, right? That was, like, a, some kind of triple dodge. Is that a special move she has? Can I read about it? That's not supposed to do that fucking two-face fight. Maybe, like, immune to bolts or some shit when I'm doing that. Uh, Catwoman. Climb, whip, swing, ceiling climb, ceiling takedown, pounce, caltrips, bolas, whip, armor, armor, no. If it's something special, I don't get uh, details on it here. So her uh, takedown from the grate is allowed. So they're going to all come here looking for this guy. Should put some caltrips down there. Over here now! I found some. No, they heard the sound, but they didn't actually know where he was. Okay, that's a good shot for us to we take down these guys here. Whoa! That was sick. Like a car, uh, fucking car, uh, takedown. Okay. That's all of them, I think. Okay. Now we can find trophies at our leisure. Oh, that's gotta hurt. So there's one up here. Did I get this one yet? No, I did not. Whee. Is that all of them here for her? Yes, there's no more here for this. 14 for Batman? Oh my god. We gotta take out these Riddler thugs, man. I ain't no way I'm gonna find those all on my, own, on my own. That's asking for too much from your boy. Ain't that smart. The fuck is this? 
Okay. For now, it's uh, 11.39, guys. I'm probably going to play for like another 20 minutes here, and then I'm probably going to play something. I haven't decided if it's going to be uh, Majora's Mask or not. After that boss fight especially, I'm feeling quite... Uh, maybe in the wrong state of mind to be playing a game that's actually demanding in any capacity. Although I hate to put off Majora's Mask because I'm already feeling like I'm pretty far behind in that game. That game's been going on for so long already. I think the solution is not to delay it more. But say la vie. So he has one up there for him. I try to get up there. That's fine. It's all part of the fun, dude. So she was DLC in this game. Which seems weird because so much of the game is engineered around her. I mean, of course, she probably planned for the game forever. But yeah, that boss fight was really whack. I feel like I want to blame the fact that it's DLC for... Oh, look, there's a fucking penguin in there. For Batman to throw a batarang at. He called that a breakable, right? Breakables. There's a loot side quest I can do with her now. But I think I'd rather play Batman and just go around and try to do the Hush side quest. I forgot about that until I saw the loading screen just now. Reminded me of Hush as a boss we gotta kill. That's a whole side quest we gotta do to get. Also, there is the thing with the political prisoners, I think, is still a thing with Batman. And uh, Riddler thugs. There's so many trophies yet to find in this world that are going unfound. It's Catwoman! Sick. You're too slow. Unfortunate. We oh, sick news. So I go, yeah, I can see where the loot is at. Oh, I see. That's kind of cool. You can see it all over town, basically. It's got a hell of a long range. But let's save that for later. Let's just go back and be Batman. I'm sick of being this chick, dude. I'm sick of being a woman. I want to be a man. Can I climb? Like I said, I have to do for now. What if I can go the slow way, honestly? Let's just go the normal way. Yeah. Mm, can't jump there. I have to whip my way up. I'm going to do a little pounce, I guess. So can I talk to this now and become Batman again? I'm sure I can. Is going to be seductive like she was? I hope so. Blowing her ear a little bit when you walk by? Oh my, how sick would that be? Here he comes, dude! There's still work to do here in Arkham City. One, she's going to be the seductive one? Come on, dude. How come I can be seductive? I'd be like, Whoosh. as I'm walking by right into her ear. Oh my. Women love that. Alright, so really, uh, I can go find a couple of his trophies at this point. But not as many as you would hope, because I need to find more of these Riddler thugs. So I think what I'm going to do is just turn on my battle vision and uh, just scope out the city. The problem is I'm colorblind as fuck, and I can't tell the guys with guns from the guys uh, that have Riddler information. I was playing to my friend Brian earlier that uh, they spawn randomly. They're not just in certain spots. They spawn literally at random, to my knowledge. Just gotta fly around and look for them, I suppose. Problem is, I can't, again, I can't tell which ones are armed and which ones are, uh... I fucking... Do you guys see that? I'm tripping. I'm tripping. Yeah, I was tripping. I thought that was, uh, one of those just uh, destructible walls. So last time we found a Riddler Thug, he was over in uh, the Joker area. Maybe... Although I just said they're totally random. Maybe they're not totally random. Maybe they spawn in like certain areas. Because there's none really around here at all. Could be because I cleaned them all out. Oh, here's uh, one of those spots. You don't think? Whoa! Jean-Claude Van Damme. John claude Van Damn! Batman. Thank you. No problem, dude. Oh, hey. Here's my peeps. 
Rest in peace, dude. Rest in peace. Hate to see it. Okay. So we're looking for uh, these orange men. Not the red men. That's bullcrap. Oh wow, it's really empowering to be Batman now after playing Catwoman. He can just kind of shoot wherever he has to go and just goes there. Don't glide kick him, man. He didn't do anything. Yeah, so I think over here, maybe there's a higher chance they're going to spawn one over here. Maybe I'm totally wrong. It's not even random. Maybe it's always the same guy. In which case, it'd be, you know, this guy over here. I kind of theorize, though, that. Uh, there's somebody over there, right? Is that a Riddler thug or something else? That's something else altogether. Right? No, it's a Riddler thug. Who's that body armor on? There's a Riddler thug. Oh, okay. So that one's got a gun. I can disable that in here. Anybody else got a gun around here? Nope. Let's uh, disable your weapon. And then uh, drop attack that guy. Don't move us somewhere else. It's Batman! <laughs> oh, fuck. I fucking got the... He picked up the gun. I thought he disarmed it. He had one the whole time. Thankfully, Batman's got way more armor than Catwoman does. Ow. Yeah, fuck your gun, dude. Stop it. It's getting pretty hairy. That guy took forever to get off the ground. <sighs> there we go. What's up, dude? What do I need to break to make you tell the truth about Riddler? You don't need to do nothing! So I, I kind of always thought that maybe they only revealed information. Oh, no, so all kinds of different areas. Okay. Cool. But still, uh, not everything I need. So we need to find more Riddler thugs. Yet. That's cool. It's kind of fun to fly over the city and try and find guys. It's not in my nose is frozen. I wonder what the deal is with the political prisoners. Are they going to tell me when I'm done with that? Or am I have to guess? There was another Riddler thug close by. I can't hardly tell the ones that have body armor apart because they've got that bright coloring as well, like the bright yellow color or whatever it is. The guy below me is Riddler's now? Oh, he is, sure enough. I'm just saying that. It's like nobody else around here. Can I just interrogate his ass? Yeah. Tell me what I want to know about Riddler or get ready So it seems as though they I'd never really explored this area, right? And got the Riddler thugs. Don't hurt me. It must be limited to different, you know, quadrants. Sectors. So about that guy over there? He's got the armor on. I see that coloration. But it, maybe he's concealing behind that his true nature as a river thug. Why is it always no. So here we found one last time. There he is right there. That's the same guy as last time. So it's not, maybe it's not random at all. That's the guy we took out. There you are, Get oh, here. they do uh, notice me. I'm kind of curious about that. If they'll notice you if you... Uh... Oh, fuck, the guy right there. You if you swing past him. Grenades! Boy, what are you grenading, dude? Spread out, we find the bitch. Got it? That been a hell of a way to take people out. I need to just loosen up a little bit. After playing Catwoman, I feel mighty, mighty stiff. I just throw a fucking smoke bomb to guys out if I wanted to. Just be hella lazy about it.
Go somewhere, dude. I wonder if Batman can run behind them. I think I tried that earlier and didn't work. Maybe only Catwoman can do it. She is, you know, more light on her feet. Even, you know, in sound design wise, you can hear him clomping around compared to her. Inside the building? This is what I'm talking about, though, right? This is, this is the guy that I killed in an accident right here. Was there, was there one inside of a building as well? Time before killing any, everyone else. I think this is the one guy. I don't think it'll happen once in the game, right? This is the one. Okay, got one guy left. Two guys, I guess. This guy's fucking exploring, dude. He's an urban explorer. Wow! Look at that leap he did. But there's one on the inside Ryan, where I said you should you reload the checkpoint and so you can get him. Then there's this spot, Ryan. I'll tell you what I know. That's what you said when I killed Good. this guy. But either way, we've been into all the interiors in the game now. Although I guess I have I, maybe the enemies don't spawn with uh, Catwoman. You know what I mean? Maybe I should uh, go back here and look around in any case. Not a whole lot of apples. I finally beat Two Face. It's a really annoying fight. Now we're kind of going around and finding Riddler Thugs. So I need to get uh, 12 total from the overworld. I see one, two, uh, three, four, five, six. So there's still Riddler Thugs a boot. For sure. They are a boot. Welcome back, apples. Oh, wow. Actually, it does work. I'm kind of surprised, but I kind of want to test it. What is that way over there in the distance? Yeah, my color bonus is not doing many favors here. Might as well just not even be in detective mode and just look for the glow. That guy looks different, maybe? Maybe not. Anybody here is glowing? I don't think anybody here is glowing. Somebody over there might be clowning, though. Wee. There's one over there to your left in the distance. I can't believe, can't believe how colorblind I am. How did she even know where it was? You'd think that at the age of 33, I would understand my own colorblindness. Like I mentioned in a... I think that's one right there, right? I pretty sure I mentioned the, the whole story about the Resident Evil and the, the pool balls, right? There's one. I want to get like a takedown. Batman, no. it's Batman. I guess a little counter he does against the, the river thugs. That was weird. It's really glitchy. They couldn't hit me because they weren't on camera, I think. Got him. I know you're lying. Shit. I'm not. Please. Got stuck watching old 11 foot 8 video. Let's talk 11 foot 8 and apples. Good night. Might be one over here, too. Yeah, I just can't believe that they actually all look the same to me. And you guys can tell them apart. This is crazy. Because, you know, they're... I guess they're, they're, what, red and orange? Or red and green? Something like that? The red ones are the ones with guns, the green ones are the ones with Riddler thugs. Something. Even with the vision on, I can see them kind of glowing, though. And nobody here has the glow. Alright, how's the map looking? What the fuck is this? There's one way out there in the boonies. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's pretty much all of them. Let's see. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I need to get one more Riddler Thug, I think. I think. Or 
Orange is armed. Green is really like, I got you, Brian. It's a camera on an old, low bridge. Just semis and trucks tearing the roofs off their vehicles. Huh? That sounds amazing. That sounds amazing. So I think there's one more thug left. Let's just go on that assumption and glide around. Although, um, my new theory is that I was totally wrong about it being random. It's not random at all. So if we, if we were to find this last thug, we have to go somewhere we haven't been yet. Which I guess would be like over where, uh, over where, uh, feel this place okay. getting worse minute by minute. Over, oh, he's running run right there. There he is. Aha. Uh -huh. This might be the last one. Thank you, Brian. No interrogate? Who's coming? You were right. We got him. Please don't lie to me. I only just got Yo, ripped please of lie to me, dude. blood off my face. Oh god, no. I'll tell you everything. That's what I wanted to hear. So I didn't get any kind of Chivo, to my knowledge, of uh, getting them all. Could there be more? I think now they should all be on my map, though, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'm miscounting. Is there maybe there's one more left, huh? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I think there's one more Riddler Thug left. Apples, I disarmed it with my magic powers. I have a gadget, Apples, that can make their guns not work. Which, you know, that's pretty cool. That's, you know, science. Gun science. Because they're also uncovering some of the ones in the buildings. Yeah, you're probably right, Brian. In fact, you're certainly right. So there's probably one left. Could be around here somewhere. Or again, it could be maybe on the side of town where like Bane's place is, you know, around the, the GCPD building. I haven't been there yet tonight. How about up there? Mm, no. Well, that was unfortunate. Ow. You ain't got shit, dog. Oh, there's one. Yes, no. It's no. Heart out here. Dude, that's hilarious. Look out. I'm 10 years old and that's hilarious to me. He kind of looks like one, but it's just his armor, I think. What's up, ICU? We already beat the game, ICU, believe it or not. Right now we're just doing post-game stuff. We have quite a lot left to do, though. We have plenty of trophies to collect still and lots of challenge maps, especially the stealth ones. I haven't really been playing with that that much. Him. Hope you have a good night. I don't know, Apples. I really don't understand this whole gun jamming from remote thing. I have like a remote control that jams guns. Guns are a pretty simple mechanism. Why didn't you do what I said? I got you some food. It was all a... Look out! It's... Look out! It's the bat! Ooh, foliage. So we finally finished all, all the political prisoners. That's great. So what does that gonna do for me? Thank you. I'm gonna find. I should go back to their camp, to right? From these animals. I should go back to the prisoner camp. Anybody around here wanna give me riddles? So that guy over there is just the. Uh, This is the armored guy. I mean, his armor is so glowy. You can see it from like a million miles away. That's cool, though. Gotta let your fucking light shine on you. He's all blinged out. Nothing wrong with that. Hmm. If I had to guess, it's probably over there. It's the remaining Riddler thug. 
Me. Me. Should be in battle vision, huh? There are some clowns, but none of them have a Riddler icon. Hey guys! Arkham City, my ass. Have I not destroyed this wall yet? What's with this? Maybe it respawns so I can knock guys out over here. Oh no, I don't want that. Anything cool in here? Nah. That's why I didn't destroy it before, huh? It's just... Just nothing. It's fun, though. I give it that. It's fun. Hmm. There's not a lot of guys out here. They're all dead already. I already killed them all. Batman style. What's this? Have I hacked this already? Whoa! Hey! I can hack this now. Reconnaissance. Reconnaissance. Okay, so what? Oh, it must show me where all the cameras are. I'll bet you. I already have all the cameras, to my knowledge. So over there is where all the political prisoners are at. But yeah, I don't see any more Riddler thugs. Maybe they are indoors. Maybe Brian's not totally tripping balls. But if that's the case, there's only a couple places it can be, right? We have to re-explore the, uh... Re-explore the... Wait! Was that at the Wonder Tower? Maybe I'm the one tripping balls. Was that when Dr. Strange was on the computer monitor talking to me? And there was, like, a ton of, like, Riddler thugs? Can we all agree that Beyond Betsy is the best-looking one? I don't know. I kind of like the standard one. This one's pretty dope. For sure. But, uh, although the standard one gets kind of old for a while, I think it's probably the best design still. This one's pretty cool, though. I gotta admit. Maybe it was... I, I kind of am having flashbacks to when I fought those guys before Wonder Tower. When Strange was talking on the computer monitor. And there was like three Riddler Thug or some shit. Maybe I took one out on accident. He be likes the 1966 bat suit. The blue one. It'd be cool if I could change, you know, while playing. Where's the fucking campground for these boys? Up here? Yeah, we should go back to that room. There was thugs there, as I recall. No, Batman and Robin is uh, out of the Clooney's best suit. It'd be cool if it was in this game. I'd probably use it, to be honest. Well, I already had all the inmates. Please. Or all the political prisoners. Help me! Thank you. I'm gonna find some place safe to hide from these animals. Oh, it always says that when I rescue a prisoner. <laughs> Never mind. But isn't this their camp, though? Where'd they all go? What? Is this where they're all hanging out for a while? The one I was remembering was in that Joker hideout <laughs> building, I believe. Thank you. Okay. Must have been a pretty early game. Maybe. Clue's the best Batman don't at me, says Hubie, huh? Oh, Brian, dude. Man. I should have known, dude. Who am I, dude? I'm not even thinking about at his best. I'm thinking about at his most drowsy. He's just playing Batman. He ain't dead. He yeah, you are right. Of course you're right. You're always right. That was, uh... There's one right there, too, though, which is convenient. Maybe there's extras in case you miss one indoors, don't make it hard for you. Anyway. Maybe the last one. If it's not, I know where to go. Don't want to lie to me. Tell me about Riddler. Yeah, it was that much, stealth room with all the fucking boilers and stuff. If you're lying, I'll come find you. So that was only for Wonder City. There's one right over there! <laughs> Yo, why is life so good, dude? Why is life so good? Oh God, it's him! 
I want answers. What's Riddler planning? No, please. This is all he told me. Thanks. I'm a wonder scene. That yeah, Clooney was cool. I think it's kind of underrated. That looks like a thug over there. Yeah, sure enough, it is. It's Batman. Is it Batman, though? Or is it all in your mind? Whoa, look at all these guys around here. Yay! It's him! Oh, my. Time relation fucked me right there. I definitely had that, I thought. It's gonna hurt, Batman. Leave the fucking knife, don't fuck with that. One guy left here. What am I doing? I'm an idiot. That was time dilation at its finest right there. This game, the way the game works sometimes. Face or legs. I don't really get it. Which one do I break first? That's fine. It works. No, look, don't hurt me. I'll talk. Of course you will. Okay. So there's still informants left. How many down there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Shabby. Eight, nine, ten, eleven still above ground. So it's still, you know, there's more. I wonder if they really are, uh, you know. I theorize there might be extra ones around town. Someone said they saw so that in case you miss one or two, uh, you don't have a big problem on your hands. But I might have to go back down there after all, right? I have to go back down to uh, the boiler room. Shout out to the boiler room. In the Joker complex. And go get that guy that I missed. He might be the last one. Oh, is there a dead guy over there? Maybe the hush quest. No, this is a dead guy. It's an old fashioned dead guy. There's a whole hush minigame to do still. I don't really know, or side quest, I mean. I don't know what to do in it. I think I have to fly around until I find a dead guy, right? Is that what the hush thing is? Dead guy finding? Kind of like dead shot, but without the, all the hints. What the hell is that up there? Probably a Riddler trophy. I'll go back at those later once I've got them all on my map. Warm. Stay warm, dude. There's a guy over there. I'm not sure if he's the right color, because I'm colorblind as fuck. But he doesn't... He's usually... Yeah, he's one of the guys. Usually if they're gun guys, they're with other gun guys. No one seen Wyatt since he went looking for something down in the sewers. Croc got him for sure. No, I don't know about that, dude. Yeah, jumping to conclusions here, I feel like. He's got a fucking baton. Wow, what a kick. They can't keep up, dude. <laughs> I'm moving too fast. Oh, I wonder if I could have closed on him from there. I thought I wasn't, thought I wasn't gonna reach. Boy, what are you doing? Drop the knife. Riddler's plans. Tell me or I'll hurt you. I'll tell you what I know. Please. Please. You don't need to hurt me. Don't hurt me, dog. So I see. Don't tase me, bro. Alright. So there's guys there that are armed. That doesn't mean they don't have secondits. It means that they're armed. It's worse. Start that guy doesn't have any seconds. I'm looking for the glow, because I can't tell the color. Who's Batman? Me? That looks like one of them. Looking a little more glowy than usual. Might just be tripping, though. I think I was tripping. Man. I got excited. No one here has the glow? I don't know. If it is the bat. Leave me alone. Too scared to fight us? Not surprised. 
You guys are fucking armed, dude. What am I got? I got fucking boomerangs. Look higher up. I'm thinking of somebody else, but if you just saw somebody, that'd be great, too. Some of there got the glow. Is that him over there at the very end? I don't know. I don't see nobody that got the glow on him. Alright, well, let's go back to uh, Joker's place. Can I harass Deadshot? That will give me great pleasure. Just for fun. Clara, the Joker's gone. Dick sees it. It's right there. Right, right there. Can't harass him? Come on, dude. Look at my nuts, Deadshot. Look at my nuts, Deadshot. Or Deadstroke, where the hell you are. Oh, my God. Okay. So let's go back to uh, Jokerland. Why are the phones always ringing? Dude, uh, trust me, they're not always ringing. I would know. I'm really tuned into them. I'd love if they did. I love that minigame. I love the Race Across Town minigame. Wish they'd ring more, but now that Zaz is caught, they stop ringing. Even when he was in caught, they still didn't ring that much. I wish that side was twice as long, to be honest. So, how do I do this thing with Hush? Hush, hush, sweet, uh, sweet, uh, Charlotte. got put in Arkham City. I'd like to get five minutes with that rich son of a bitch. Whee. Is this suit better at gliding than the other suit? That couldn't be, right? They don't have special properties to them, but I feel like it seems easier to glide around. Probably just my imagination. Running away with me. Yeah, it's just my imagination. Running away with me. Wee. I hear police cars? Why? From where? Wee. Straight out of Gotham stinking city. Hell, I'll even get bloody. What? Hear that sound effect? I guess it's the sound when you get out of range of them talking before they're done talking? That was weird. You're know, like hung up on me. Just going to keep snow. Hmm. Weird. Alright. I wanna be around here. Wee. He's not a really thug, no, it's just a just a dude. Just a dude and a half. Oh shit. There you Ow. Bye, bitch. Run! So I have way more armor than Catwoman does. Which is kind of fun, I guess. Kind of makes sense thematically. She is just a dainty lady wearing a skin-tight latex suit. And I'm, uh, you know, super ripped dude wearing a skin-tight latex suit. Okay, so let's see. So, uh, where was that entrance again? It was over here. You have to look for the... There's like a big blown-up hole on this side. I had a nice little that right there, right? Hang out of it. Yes. He's still burning. Alright, here I am. Find this dude. Prove our theory that, uh... That it's not random. It's gonna be the, He's gonna be a really thug for sure, right? Because I killed him last time. So he should still be there. I'm surprised there's nobody here. Where am I going exactly? Yeah. Uh, there's still breakables around here too, like a lot of breakables. Also a riddler, uh, a riddle, a riddle. A riddler, riddle, riddle. Boy, you have a quite long, uh, a lot of this game yet to go, it would seem. It's a biggin'. 
We'll have time to knock it out next week, right? We have tomorrow's stream. We've got all of next week, and that shouldn't be much longer than that. If I had to guess. All right, so we got a hint here. Oh, look it. There's one right there for Batman, too. Well, that's a... I'm going to say there's a good sign. That, you know, I should be able to find a way in there at some point. It's not just one random thing over there. It's, you know, a couple things over there. But still, that's still crazy. Uh, I've been down here, right? Where did this go? Well, it doesn't really matter where it goes because uh, Catwoman can't go there. Nice little parkour animation there. Like, that's actually kind of sick. Whatever was down here, I probably already got it, right? It doesn't go anywhere. No. Oh, the glass, uh, the, the ice did eventually shatter, huh? Up there. Oh, is it the guys? So I gotta take a photo of is the actual guys. I'm an idiot. Because there's some guys here, right? <laughs> just the actual dudes. So I'm like, hell, I can just get in here and do this, right? She can't do that. So there's no thugs here. So they stay dead. I don't think it's admissible or anything. So, uh, maybe people just spawn somewhere else. In any case, there is this to destroy. So I have no reason to be here, then. I don't think I want to collect all the goodies until, uh... Well, I mean, it says I have four missing. One, two, three, four. So I can see where... I can see all four. We might as well get them all over here, right? Sure we should. Except for Catwoman's ones. I, I can't mark things on the map for some reason when you're inside of a building. It's kind of a drag. Let's just clean this place out. Hold that shit. This room is cleaned out, not except for Catwoman and stuff. The more I love you, sitting, you know, smoking, feeling high. Perspective puzzles, huh? There's a Riddler trophy right fucking there. Or maybe not right there. Where was it again? Man, that's room, huh? So here's a perspective puzzle, huh? Like, what is it all about? Uh, is it below me? Hey, no me! Don't you below me? There's a cable going to that, which is kind of weird. Perspective puzzle? Am I tripping balls? Is it underneath me? It's a riddle there, it says. But I don't see no dot or nothing. Dot? Circle, circle, dot, dot? Now I have my cootie shot? Hmm. Well, what is this? There's a thing. You can see the cable going over here. Where do this is, J-Bomb? Without me, a chain is nothing, nor can a site be visited, huh? I don't know, j -Bomb, what is it? A link? A borte? How's it been, j -Bomb? Is it a borte? I'm not sure, j -Bomb. I'm not sure I'm going to play Zelda tonight. I'm kind of not really got any sleep last night. I'm leaning toward just playing Batman all night long. Or doing something else. I mean, your weekend was pretty good, dude. Or that your uh, Tuesday was good. Then Batman it up, dude, or rest. I'm going to do one or the other or both. In any case, I'm having a pretty good time. It's pretty laid back. It's not very demanding to kind of wander around and collect goodies. Look at this cool hammer. Oh, is that a, the riddle? Oh. Cool. So it wasn't the one that it said it was, which is kind of annoying, but hey, whatever. 
But I, I guess the other ones don't give you hints where they're at, huh? That kind of makes sense. Or maybe it does. Maybe it's this one right there. Wee. So he can actually uh, make rafts and shit. Might not have to if I'm lucky, though. That whole part's pretty annoying. Well, as crazy as this, J-Bomb. Brian. Smart guys. Dicks, of course, also very smart. Shout out to Tokitori. How do I get inside there, dude? That's crazy to me. We tried it last time. I, did, I got nothing. I got nothing. It's one of those problems like in Majora's Mask, Brian, where it seems like it should be so simple. And it probably is. But that's exactly why I can't figure it out. Because I'm coming at it from the wrong angle. Uh, you think I just have to come at it from this side or something. But there's nothing. Can I get up there? Oh my god! Okay. It really was that simple. Okay. So now what? Combat expert? Let's fucking go. So there's a riddle here. Easy game, Brian. That's my problem, Brian. I'm making games too easy these days. That's why I'm getting so salty against Catwoman. What the fuck? Can I get over there, please? I want to get over there. No! I can't use another grenade. It will make the ice please. too unstable. Oh, uh, it's going to put me back where, where I want to be. I think it is, right? Okay, good. So, where did the thing was? Uh, right here. Perspective. Oh, there it is. I gotta stand, uh, I gotta put a raft right there. Perhaps. Don't die, though. Kinda awkward. Okay, that's nice. Is there a reason why, why water is no good? Is it radioactive? I, well, we're at a factory. So yeah, it's probably like hella radioactive or poisoned. We can see it bubbling and shit. But in general, Batman can't seem to swim. He always dies in water. I don't think it has to be poisonous water for him to die in it. He's just that kind of guy. Draw! Too slow, bitch. What else is around here? Uh, a breakable, and that's it. The exit. I come back on the other side and get more of these things. All right, cool. Doesn't have his bat pool noodle with him. It'd be sick if he did, though. I'd be sick if he did. He's got a destructible wall up there. But it's not. Can I get back this way? Oops. Where am I going? I'm gonna sneeze here, guys. You guys don't mind. <coughs> Please excuse me. Guys, check out the YouTube channel. I put up a new video this morning, or this afternoon, I guess. Explaining our viewers' choice uh, pizza and movie stream on Friday. I spent 10 minutes or 13 minutes detailing uh, all the films that are you know, up for voting right now. There's 12 films to vote for. We're picking the top three votes, or the top three movies, in terms of popularity. And we're watching them. It's gonna be amazing. Pull it! You can vote on YouTube, you can vote on Twitter, or vote wherever you want, really. I don't really give a fuck. I'm always not in the Twitch chat. In my Twitch chat is not really like archived effectively for that purpose. But Patreon is great, Twitter is great, Facebook is great, or just in the YouTube comments. Let me know which films you want to watch on Friday. Oh, can I not jump to that? Because it's all spiky. Hup! Oh, I can. That was pretty nice. Hmm, but that ain't gonna work. Man! Fuck. Like, really? Oh, shit. I gotta go back, dude. How am I gonna get in here now, though? Oh, yeah, I have to go in the other way. Yeah, okay, it's fine. 
You guys been watching Hubie's stream? You guys like Hearthstone? Can I just glide into there? Whee. I can. Pretty laid back stream. This is the way I like it. Right, cooling tunnel. Uh huh. Let me go up here. Mm -hmm. He streams, dude. Hearthstone. Give him that follow, dude. It's a very cool stream. Puts a lot of work into it. I respect it as a, as a, you know, a full-time streamer. When I go to a stream and it seems like it's, you know, well engineered, sounds good, looks good, good hosting, welcoming community. To me, that's a huge, huge plus. There are a lot of streams out there. You know, I love streams people do just just for fun. This kind of streamer just to hang out with their one of their one or two friends or whatever. Their their homies, Maybe so their, their best friend can watch them play or whatever. That's cool. But it's a very different kind of thing when you're putting in a lot of work into it. It's a whole different sort of uh, yeah undertaking. All the things we don't have here says Brass. I'm saying, dude. That's why I love it so much. It's a nice change of pace. From our shitty ass community, shitty ass stream, shitty whiny salty hosting. We're getting somewhere here. Aha. Seems like, hey, got a face cam, hey. At least our community isn't Smash Bros. bad. I don't know about Smash, although we did we played Smash for a while on this channel, J Bomb. Those guys were very, very young. I like them on Cat Stevens' song, How's It Go? Shout out to Yusuf Islam. Where am I? I'm where I want to be, darling with you. The music's made that way. Yeah, there's plenty to do around here. Mm, my god. Brian Axe. We need fucking dicks here. I know Dix hasn't been paying attention to Batman that much. He's not really his long play of choice. But we need him now. He's like our Goku here. How are we gonna find this last fucking Riddler trophy without his help? We need his big ass brain. They're quite underage indeed, yeah. New Hearthstone expansion tomorrow. Hype! What comes in expansion? I never played Hearthstone in my life. What does an expansion entail? Like a bunch of new cards? Like how many new cards are you talking? Didn't Ashes of Outland just come out like two months ago, says J Bomb? I'm just trying to capitalize on this, uh. on this COVID 19 thing, man. People are at home right now. I have to get. somewhere! So there's 135 in each expansion. There's three expansions a year. Huh? Okay, that's a lot of expansions. Can't move it anymore. What is with this thing down here, dude? Why is it? What is it doing there, man? It's driving me insane. It's not on the map. It's gotta be on the map. How could it not be on the map? It's senseless. It's madness. It defies reason. The map describes, you know, a physical place that things can exist in. It's out there in the void. It's out there in the void. Oh! 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 I gotta swing this thing the other way. But how? Oh, we need to use physics. Oh my god! Mistime that. Let's go. 
I was mashing buttons trying to just if I could like this. Just doing everything. Yes! The void! The void. Where the fuck? There's a lot going on here, honestly. But where's hers? Oh, there it is. She gets over, she has to climb the ceiling. Oh, okay, we can do it now, fuck. When Blizzard sells an expansion for 80 bucks a pop, you would make a, you would make produce as many as you can, as you can. You might make a bunch of cards to make it worthwhile. It's sad that what they did to this game on PC. Yeah, in general, the w, uh, WB games don't run that well on PC, right? I'm running on PC right now. That's fucking amazing. Like, it's a 10 out of 10 experience, but this is, you know, years later, with much more powerful hardware. But yeah, I love it, dude. I love it. I you doing, Kemi Shin? The first, I think, three ran fine. Or first two. Yeah, this is the second game in the series. But yeah, I think Arkham Origins, the third one, and uh, Arkham Knight both ran like shit, right? QB plays Arena. That's where most of the, my cards uh, come from, huh? You're free to play. That's the way you do it, dude. Yeah, last one, I can make it run fine now on PC. But again, it's a much stronger machine than we would have had back when the game came out. They have also patched it a little bit, too. But it's a real shame. All right, cool. So now we have to go to the basement, destroy that thing, and we'll be done here with Bat and Mang. It's simple. We kill the Bat and Mang. But it's a shame I mow they lost so much on the game, huh? Yeah, maybe it's a shame. I don't know. It was not my favorite game in the series, for sure. Arkham, uh, Arkham Knight. I had big issues with that game. I think that it's, you know, it's shitty PC port are indicative of a much larger problem with the franchise, which is that, you know, they were sort of cashing in at that point. They didn't really give as much of a fuck. If that game had went well, we would have had a fourth, huh? I don't know. I mean, I think it did pretty well on console, right? Am I wrong about that? You have to think it did fine. Oh my god! Oh my god! Wow. This is the real final boss. Oops. Yeah, I don't like the driving. That's what I mean. I think that the problem that game had with its port on PC was really more of a larger problem with that game just sort of being a little bit ass. Not super duper ass. Not Nicki Minaj ass. But just ass. Oh, look at this shit. What's all this nonsense? Oops. Um, I want uh, I want this. <laughs> Fucking why the coyote fall right there? That game only had like seventy-three thousand copies sold. Really, Kami Jin? Compared to what Arkham City sold? Why? That don't seem right. That don't seem right. That's what I needed. That's what I needed. Made about a million dollars total. What? That's embarrassing. The game probably cost 10,000 bajillion dollars to make. I don't want to be here. I want a GTFO. No, not here either. That ain't gonna help me. What about Arkham Knight, uh, Dicks? That seems like an awfully low figure. Go back up. Oh, I'm trying to. There we go. Don't kill me, please! Ooh. That would have been unfortunate. They're both in the 10 to 14 million dollar range. At release, the game was the fastest selling game in 2015, and the fastest selling game in the Arkham series, reaching over 5 million units sold globally by October 2015, huh? I gotcha. That's good. I wonder how its overall, you know, total lifetime sales are compared to Arkham City, for instance. But yeah, I think we did okay. Alright, where am I going here? I want to go out this way. 
Then come into the front door, or the back door, I guess, in this case. All right, cool. What time is it now, guys? 12.35, hmm, what do I want to do here? This would be a good time for us to go on a very short break, come right back with something, if not this. Hmm. What could we play? Leap! Nice hops, dude. I respect that. So I gotta go around the back side of this place. Give it a smack on the ass. There's lots of thugs over here, though. I can't open the door till I kill them all. Man! I play games to escape reality, dog. What is with this fucking... There's a trophy out in the void over here, too. Not at all, Kevin. We're a very long way from that. Super long way from that, in fact. Hell a long way from that. Probably have another week at least. If not more than a week left. Is there something over there? What is that over there? Can I walk on that? Walk out on a high wire. You're a dancer on thin ice. You pay no heed to the danger. And less to advice. Oh, that was really fun. Well, look at what we have here. Right. That was easy. We're gonna play Harley Quinn's Revenge after 100% main story. Ah, uh, yeah. If it's in this DLC, I don't remember that in this game, but sure. If it's a part of this game, then yeah. Talking about night, not city. Yeah, we're talking about Arkham Knight. City sold one point, uh, excuse me, twelve million copies. That's up until January this year, huh? Let's see here. That was fun. How far can I go? Probably not that far, you would think, right? No, not that far at all. We have I got this one yet? Arkham Knight was a good game, too. I mean, it's, it's got a lot of stuff in it, which is great. A lot of good stuff in it. But it's just kind of flabby. It's a flabby game. Got a lot of f stuff in it that only dragged it down. Jump, Batman, jump. Jump, jump. So you're going to destroy a Harley Quinn. With my electro gun. Blop! That's all of my thing. Not sure if that's only for an achievement. I guess it probably is, right? What else could it be in this game? Not a whole lot, aside from achievos. But there's still uh, two Catwoman trophies in here. I can get them both. Why don't we do that and then go on break? Well, this place totally cleaned out. It'll be totally done with. It'll be totally over. So where can I be her? Right here. Character switch point. I want to be seductive again. I should do my entire stream talking like this, guys. Hey, guys, what's up? I have to breathe in a lot because you're talking with so much breath in your voice. How are you guys doing? Scale of 1 to 10, and you better say 10. All right. So, uh, tri corner navel, huh? Your navel has three corners? I don't even have one corner. It's round. I dig deep, build a wall, and lock us inside it. We. Good plan. Batman, he's here! That's so much fun, dude. So we gotta turn into a cat. Over here, I guess, huh? Then we'll go back inside there. Grab the last two trophies we're missing. What's up with this weather? Whoa, Batman! Be careful! Watch this. Oh, look at this cool little shiny thing in this chest. That's kind of fun. It's like a shiny bat symbol. Okay. Sexual harassment. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, my God. Girl, don't I touch me, to girl. This. Don't put your hands on me. All right. That's totally out of line. All right. Let's see here. Yay. 
Her animation is way better than Batman's, I'm sorry. Her leaping and using her whip is so much more fun than gliding. Gameplay-wise, it feels a bit more clunky, unfortunately, but it looks so much cooler. Is that cool, Cammy Yeah, Batman Beyond suit. Oh, fuck. You're not armed, are you? Eh, kind of. Come fight me, cat bitch! I did Oh, I want to get away and fucking stomp that guy, but too slow. Oh, that's like some Matrix shit. You ain't getting past me! Ow. Both hands. I feel like I could use your little zap jig. Come on, go up there. Wait, can she climb any wall? Even though there's not something above her to latch onto? What if I were to go, let's say, uh, for instance, uh, right here? Can I just R1 my way up? No, I can't. Okay. So I gotta get up uh, to uh, the top. Tippy tippy top. Am I going the right way even? I'm sure I am, right? I hope so. Climb it. Get up there. Yeah, so I want to be over here actually. Jump off. It doesn't make any sense to whip, like physically. That's cool. I don't think it'll make sense physically. I'm here for that. Fuck physics. Go ahead and drop off if you don't mind. So in here, there's two more for her. I know where one is right off the bat. The other one, not so much. I'm gonna take a bit more searching. After that, I'm gonna put the break screen up and then meditate in a very sleepy fashion. Probably chat for a few minutes with you guys with no idea of what I'm gonna do for a minute of the stream until an idea just strikes me. I mean, they could add one of those latch hooks, huh? It's not so much that. It's more the fact the way that it stretches. I don't really mind that it grabs things. I'm more concerned about the fact that she kind of just throws it out and then she kind of kind of like sucks her into things it's like very it's kind of like one of those rubber band or one of those uh, slimy hands you buy no zelda tonight i'm thinking no zelda almost certainly not i feel like shit i feel like super like shit majora's mask is majora's ass huh oh shit oh, there's another one of these now. how am i gonna get over there yeah, i kind of hoping i'd feel better than i did when i started and i think i do a little bit I'm not buying enough to be fucking with another actual game tonight. I feel physically demolished. I like Majora's Mask. I'm really enjoying it, Kamijin. I think Dix is being facetious anyway. We. Dix is not a huge fan of retro games in general. We. I'm enjoying it a lot. I think it might be my favorite Zelda game so far. Dix likes Taylor Swift, Kemi Jen. He likes the B team from uh, from software. I do a mage. Raging mage, sage. Someone here. I gotta do like a slide or something. They're all still dead. I thought I just liked T-Swift Dicks, but you show me the light. I think it really likes the mask switching and the Scarecrow in particular. I really hate the Scarecrow most of all. I hate that more than mask switching, Brian. Like, now that you mention it, to me that's like the worst thing imaginable. It's insanity. Where am I going here? It's right in front of my face. On the ceiling? Sure it is. I can't jump up there. I have to go off the edge and then maybe climb underneath. Huh? Oops. Go here. She doesn't want to do it, though. I just gotta retry this down here. I mean, can I just whip it? It is right there. Can I grab things with this? No, not really. What if I were to grab the edge, like, here, and then just hold it? Climb the ceiling. There we go. It'd help if Venka didn't make every game he touches 50 hours longer than it needs to be, huh? That would definitely help. Trying to work drunk and just uh, got done making, uh, just got done playing Monster Hunter, huh? Streamer, you take too long. Play better. Get good, streamer. No! 
I don't want to get good. I want to stay bad. Got me again. I think it's like I fell for that. Get the bang for the buck. I guess you'd be. I guess. That's like chat with you guys and trying to find every little thing and staring at a lot of walls. I don't want to pay for new games, yeah. Who does the content amount you pay for these days is shit. Who does the content amount you pay for these days is shit. I think I misunderstand you, Kami. Uh, Kami. Who does? The content amount you pay for these days is shit. Some games have a lot of content. Yeah, I think I, I, think I got a dicks, yeah. Some games have very little content. Other games have like an insane amount of content. This game, for instance, this game, you know, it's a, uh, it's legendary though. This game is not really a. Uh, it's an exception that proves a rule, right? This game is just so great in every single way. This game has a ton of content. It's really fun to do. I'm loving this fucking treasure hunt. This is a very brainless treasure hunt, but it's kind of fun to explore and you know solve some puzzles. Look at walls. These are games that should be like 40, 30, 20 dollars. This game is worth 60 bucks for sure. But I mean, a lot of games these days, yeah, well, you know, the, the uh, value per hour of gameplay is totally relative to your income level as well as to, you know, what you're looking for in a game. I'm not sure I'm comfortable saying that, you know, a game is worth a st amount strictly based on the amount of content it has or how long it takes to beat it or whatever. I do agree that a lot of games are pretty sparse these days. However, they're, how much they're worth. All right, cool. That was fun. So, uh, here we have Batman stuff we could knock out, too. Oh, there's 14 in there, though. Man, I don't want to fuck with that, I don't think. I can't even see Batman's trophies while I'm Catwoman. Uh, okay. Where'd all the food go? I'd say that for most of the current AAA games, though. I think that, uh, this game is fucking amazing. Put a positive spin on it. This game is fucking godlike. This game has so much you can do. I just wish there was more. I really feel like, you know, that's what should, the, the sequel should have been. More of what was good about this game. But instead, they ended up doing it like a whole different, you know, they added a bunch of new stuff that nobody really asked for. Except those that really were asking for it. That's why they did it. Right? I think in the shower the other day, right, about how the problem with the Batmobile and Arkham Knight is that they had, they wanted to include it. So they forced it in. Because the way the Batmobile behaves, uh, as a concept, as an idea, is contrary to what makes these games so good. But the fans demanded it. The fans demanded the Batmobile, and why wouldn't you? It completes the fantasy of being Batman that the game's all about. But it doesn't really work. It doesn't really work in this game, uh, you know, in the engine, mechanically speaking. So they had to force it in somehow. So they had all these dumb new mechanics to make it feasible to, to do. Oh, though. That's cool. Ghost is good. One raging that is probably worth 60 bucks on huh? a raging mage stage. I saw my friends playing it, and it's one of those kind of games that I guess you have to play it to really appreciate it. I watched my friends playing it over the weekend, and I was like, wow, this game kind of looks like ass. Like, I was really taken aback. I was like, this is the game that people are raving about? This game? But, uh, I probably just didn't get it. She has very strong arms. Nothing turns me on more than a woman with strong arms. Oh, fuck. See that? I almost fucking fell to my death. I made it past. Sick. Tempted by ghosts. Heard nothing but good things about it, says J-Bomb. Uh, you know, I think, uh... It kind of reminds me of, like, an Assassin's Creed game. But it's in Japan. But made in the West. There's still work to do here in Arkham City. It's like, boy, I ain't even talking to you, dude. Where'd she go? That's just water down there. She can't swim. Rest in peace. All right, guys, I think we're going to reach our break here. here. Let's do a challenge map first. Then I'll go on break. Then I'm going to get a shake. We'll chit chat for a while. I'll think about if I want to play another game tonight if I want to end the stream early. I'm probably going to play something. I've got to think of what it is. I think it's going to be this game. A 
Let's see. Riddler's Revenge, sure. Maybe we got some new challenge maps, like new combat challenge, like the punchy ones. I know I love the punchy ones. What do we got here? Oh my god. We gotta be, uh... This one, for sure. How many we unlock? We've unlocked, uh... Nothing! Oh, I'm so disappointed. Well, how? I thought for sure... What, what are those things? Top of the world, Lost City, Meltdown Man, Police Reality. Were they all... What were those things called? Uh, campaigns? They're all campaigns. Search and Destroy, Street Justice, Offensive Maneuvers, City Invader, Predator Expert. Yeah, Combat Expert. Oh, but it's all fights. Oh, let's do this one then, dude. It's a campaign of all fights. I really don't want to fuck with the, with the stealth ones, man. I think that they're kind of not my speed, the stealth ones. Oh, I think I lost a chat here on my side. I guess they're talking over here on this. Uh, uh, enjoy your shake, Venka. You deserve a little bit of flavor. Open world's pretty meh. Combat is good. Characters are all right. Some neat abilities, but stealth is still kind of lame. I don't have the detention span to the, for the story, so I can't comment on that. My thing about... Uh... The stealth I saw from my friends playing it is it appears to just be Assassin's Creed stealth slash, you know, Horizon stealth. Just going to a, some high grass and that's it. Well, my, my stream died and I lost a chat. See, that's kind of a drag. See, if you guys said some stuff, I missed it there. If you guys said some stuff, I missed it. Time limit adds a time limit to complete the challenge. Defeat enemies to extend your time. Oh, I get modifiers? Why? Increased aggression. Oh, maybe the points multipliers, huh? Oh. Gun racks will be activated during the challenge for enemies to obtain firearms. Yeah. Give me all these, dude. Just talking about ghosts while I was out. Huh? You want some? It's kind of a really fun looking costume, yeah. We're gonna Oh, I couldn't fucking take that guy out over there. Better hurry. I need to actually, I don't know, with all my modifiers on me, I don't even have to like do mix-ups. Got him! Don't rub it in, dicks. Are you looking for me? Are you looking for me? So how am I doing for a score here? I'm not sure what my goal is. I already forgot. This is gonna be a hoot and a half though. Let's put in some variations for fun. There's the takedown. Oh fuck. Oh, dilation didn't work for me there. Oh, nobody there. I wanted to get the uh, the beat down. I get back in the zone here. Maybe I'm too tired for this. Come to think of it. Oh, that was sick. <laughs> That was stupid as fuck, but it was sick. Oh, it was godly. Rubbing and sucking are kind of my thing, says Dick, son. Nothing wrong with that, dude. You're going down. Okay. So I'm doing good on medals already. I need medals for every single map. Oh, okay. Different number for every map. Okay. Need gadgets and gizmos. Oh no, I forgot how to play this game. Okay. Somebody has a gun. Oh, that's not a counter icon, that's a dodge icon. I think I'm a little bit too drowsy for this. But we might have a shot anyway, though. I think with all these multipliers on, it's gonna give me a, like a really high score. I'm not really multiplying stuff very well. Oh, 
Oh, look at it. They scared all his friends. Interesting. Okay, variation there. So I already hit the goal for this stage. I'm only on the third round, or is that the end? You are mine. Okay, so I have one more round left just to get score and get back in the you know get back in the flow here. Oh no, I totally had no idea what I put without pressing there. The drowsiness is real. I just kind of like hit buttons. I wanted to have the, uh... My brain said to send the, uh... The bat gel out, but my hand was like, well, how do we do that again? Like that. Oh no! That bad gel is so weird. Yeah, it's way more covered than it looks. Like when you're when you're like walking afterward, kind of like there's a little cool badass step. I can't actually interrupt the animation. It's just sort of like you trigger the bomb and you sort of kind of hang there for a second. Oh, what the fuck? I can counter that. So yeah, I got the score I needed anyway. I have to worry about time now. So I gotta do stuff like this. Let's do nothing but ground takedowns. Amazing. Wow, I'm just saying. Wait, is it getting time back or something? I thought I only had like 40 minutes, uh, 40 seconds left there. Metals zero plus three, it says. I put on three modifiers. So does that mean to get three free metals in the end or something? But don't I only need three medals? I'm not sure I understand. Maybe it means plus three because I just finished that map, so I added those three to my... I don't know. Let's find out. Okay. So we added these ones, all right. Are they still added Isn't in? this a school night? These guys I can dis disarm destroy with I Batman! I better first round. But I think that my modifiers are, are canceled out. Like I only use them like once per You're going down. Once per stage, man. Once per campaign. You scared. How that works? This won't take long, but we'll be quick. This is a really sick costume, actually. Whoa! I can also disarm and destroy. I gotta use my gadgets here. Oh no, what was that? He got hit by the fucking battering and my thing at the same time. So, that's not how that should have worked. It should have not prioritized him like that, but... The last game had way more bugs like that. Yeah, if I throw out three batarangs and then I shoot my thing, it should it should not target the guy that also being targeted by the batarang. But Bring it on. I need a very high score here. Let's say we already got twenty thousand. You're gonna die here. So yeah, Riddler. Uh, we got uh, armor thugs for days around here. I gotta be careful. Let's just take him out right off the bat. Flip one more face. Ah. Oh, you 
They're gone now. Oh no! Time dilation. We'll kill you, bat. We'll make sure this hurts you, freak. They are down for the count, Dob. This is actually crazy. That was extremely lucky. Not lucky there. I got pretty well. Holy shit, that worked out well. How's it been, Lamar? First of all, pretty good you. My night's going awesome. Dude, look at that fucking variation right there, dog. That's actually not as good as I wanted it to be. What did I forget? Uh, uh, let's see here. Uh, I didn't do the stomp. I can do the, the cape and the stomp. I always forget to do that one. It's kind of risky. Probably best I do that after I do my uh, my cape thing. Right? I didn't do the multi-hit takedown, the multi-ground takedown. Fair enough, dude. I didn't do uh, just armor strike. Oh no! Why won't you die? Yikes! You're not so strong. I killed you with one hand. Okay. Ridiculous. You should run, Batman. I need to uh do a beat down. I need to do triple stun. Uh bring a gadget. This Okay, that's pretty good. Oof. But I know I forgot something there. What we got? What are we looking at? 11? It's like a new high for me, dude. That's a new high for me. 11? That's crazy. Not sure if you ever played uh, Onimusha. I have not, uh, Lawnmower Face. No, I would like to, though. I wish a remake would be made. Anybody know about Ghost? We're talking about Ghost right now, in fact. Yeah, exactly, Dix. I'll have to check out some gameplay for Ghost. It plays out like a newer Assassin's Creed games, but better combat if that helps, huh? That was really good. One map left here, guys. As a part of our campaign. So I have six medals. I have three retries still? Okay. Prison Riot. Zoot Suit Riot. This is not I hear uh, batons. Fuck your baton. Could have done that better. 
I could have stomped somebody. I got, I got a bunch of... Oh, yeah, eight, that's not bad for the first round. Eight? This is gonna hurt. It's really empowering after playing Catwoman. that counts. So he's gonna keep doing this instead of Majora's Mask? I don't think so, Dix. This is my last, uh, my last challenge here before I move on to something else. Survival horror is your favorite of genres to play. I thought Last of Us 2 was pretty good. Is it really survival horror? I didn't know that. I'm not sure I would find it that same way, but I haven't played it or even seen gameplay of it yet myself. Yeah, not terrible, not terrible score there. Could be better. Whoa, he's behind me! <laughs> oh, there's an armor guy there. Fuck. Too dark. See the animation that's kind of crazy looking. Oh, I didn't need that. I need the stomp. Yeet! Neo 2 survival horror. You've got to be pretty good to survive that horrible game. Wow, j Bomb. Burn, dude. You fools Fucking are going down. Killed them fools, too. So I'm getting pretty, uh, that same kind of score for all these matches. Eight. Is Neo bad, Kimmy? No, Neo is godly. Well, Neo 1 is bad, if you ask me. But Neo 2 is godly. Neo 1 has his apologists. There's just a lot going on here. I think I'm gonna take you down. Oh no, what the fuck? It's okay, I already have a score I need. Got him. Okay, fuck this up. Try and bait the knife guy to come toward me. Time dilation, holy shit. I had that early start up there. Okay, could have been better there for sure. Neo one's kinda hit and miss, but two is an all-around improvement. Yeah, Neo's great. It's pretty good to J-Bomb. I just wanted to tweak Vinka's nose a bit. J-Bomb just wouldn't know good taste if it shoved its fat cock down his bitch ass throat. God damn, dude. Okay, so now what happens? Nine out of nine. Okay, so that's what you have to do for these. New PP? Sick. So you have to get... So I guess the challenge is add a free medal? Like when you have the optional challenges? For each map? So that first map I put on three at once. So I guess that meant that I had that map for free? Maybe? Dix would know, Cambridge. For sure Dix would know. I'm going to give a short break here, guys. Come right back in a few minutes with something. I haven't decided what yet, but I'll have a shake and we'll talk about it. I'll think of something to play here that's going to be a little bit more laid back than Batman. It's a lot of fun tonight, though. Super fun tonight. I'll see you guys in a few minutes with a uh, question mark. For now, uh, if you guys want to get some snacks and stuff, I would totally uh, endorse that decision. That's what I'm going to do. This game is so good. So what do we got here? We've got uh, challenge maps, uh, 3D character models, 
Harley Quinn's revenge. Oh, okay. So that's what that is. So yeah, we have to do that then. Sick oh, Andy. Sick Andy. New game plus. Oh, nice. so Concept nice. art. Nice. Watch the credits again? No thanks. Sick. Sick. Thank you for those mixing channel possible, guys. I was up all night last night working on some uh, pizza and a movie stuff for Friday, guys. I got 12 movies downloaded. I mean, let's see here. I downloaded more than 50 movies last night. Uh, out of, you know, uh, as to say, 50 uploads of 12 different films. I compared them all side by side, see which ones were the best. Uh, it was a uh, quite an undertaking, but what's kind of cool about it is that not only are you prepared now for oh, like, pizza and movie viewers' Dude, choice on Friday. Go vote, guys. Check out my YouTube channel for the, the uh, on, details on that. But go vote. We're gonna watch. But it's kind of cool that the films that don't make it, we can save for a future pizza movie. I already have all their stuff figured out. So it's kind of like I, you know, got a few pizza movies set up, you know, all in one night, which is probably a, not the best Yo, idea. Tor I probably should have gone for nine films to the twelve as well. At the start of the oh project, it seemed like it was gonna be as big of a deal as it ended up being, but you know. We accomplished it. I, I got, you know, five hours of sleep last night, which is a pretty good amount of sleep, I suppose. Again, some people don't even get that ever. I, not quite five, but close to five. This could be a lot worse. I know, I'm sure everybody in this chat has been there before. And probably even less, less sleep than that. But it's a lot of fun, guys. It's, it's a lot of work, but it's a lot of fun. You guys make that possible through Patreon, through Twitch subs. And just by being here, by helping out that way. It's not, the, uh, it's not uh, excuse me, I'm so tired. If not for you guys being here, there would definitely be, uh, there would definitely be uh, no channel here. There'd be no stream. I couldn't do it by myself, for sure. Other cameos all the time, huh? You've got an S-Box, thank you. S-Box. Soft box. That's my ex-girlfriend used to have. You know what they say, 20 bucks is 20 bucks is a lawnmower, that's true. Sometimes even more than 20 bucks. A seed box, huh? Not sure what seed box is. But I'm going to get up here, guys, and grab a shake, uh, use the bathroom and stuff, and think about what I want to do for the remainder of the stream. We have about uh, a couple hours left to do something cool. I don't want to do anything like Hassie Bounce. Not DLing bulk yet, then. Not DLing bulk. What I do is I find public domain films, and I search for them on rarbg.tv, I think and Pirate Bay, Archive.org, and if I can't find any good films that way, like, in terms of quality, I go to YouTube as well, which is, like, my last resort. Basically, I find films that are public domain by doing, you know, searches, and then I browse the web on various different platforms to try and find the highest quality upload of that film, which for public domain films is oftentimes very difficult because they're not especially, you know, widely released, or let me rephrase that. They're not widely released at high quality. So a seed box is like what you would plastic. use if you really got into like plaques. And the Ellen for instrument. downloading for the most you can and seeding for private trackers. I don't know what the, any of that means, Kimmy Jim. But I'd be surprised if it was effective for my needs. Now I have to you know target specific films from certain eras and download them on an individual basis, I believe. I can't imagine there's some way I could do it in bulk. They're playing material magic on that thing, yeah, really fast material magic, dude. Doing hella commands. That's Between a hell of a seeding box. They made me say seeding box. What's up, Katie? Nothing wrong with seeding boxes, dude. Do do do. You're talking about piracy, Katie. Your favorite subject. Maybe Kevin's going to teach you about piracy a little bit. Do. Hasn't that been Katie? Ask Katie about the OD TV movie cartoon anime collection I got on Plex, huh? I don't know what it is about piracy. What are you talking about, Venka? I'm talking about like, uh, you know, like, you know what I'm talking about, Katie. I'm talking about like uh, downloading Google media Plex. in violation of copyright on the World Wide Web. <laughs> He's like, what do you, what do you mean? Something, dude. I'm thinking about pirating uh, Inuyasha, guys. 
moving on. When I was a kid, I had this game, Inuyasha Feudal Fairy Tales, on PS1, and I can't seem to find it. I think it's still in the house somewhere. I'm not sure I lent sorry, it out to yes. anybody, but I think about sorry, downloading yes. it to play it on stream. Would have cost me so much? A movie comparison? I did on YouTube, Lawnmower Face, yeah, where I detailed how I do my pizza in a movie, you know, between streams work. There's a video on YouTube where I detail, like, what I go through when I set up pizza in a movie, where I compare film side by side. Katie's too innocent and pure to steal content. You're just seeding the wrong boxes, huh? You've got to worry about child support. Wow, dicks. I'm going to get up and get my uh, food, guys, and be right back.